The mic's not on because I'm a doofus. So let me start over. That was a that was a terrible way to start a stream apparently because I forgot to unmute the mic. Uh, Brayden, Mr. Farm Guy, Navy, Samantha, Brendan, Josh, Gene, how's it going? Joel, Dad Wolf, I say Benji. I already said half of these, so I'm like trying to remember which ones I haven't said. Steven, Wombat, Farmer Jane Doe, Lord Dark Ian. Luis, McLeary, how's it going? Alex, Eric, Holt, Mark, John. I think I got everybody. Hey, everybody that's chatting, welcome in. Everyone who's lurking, I love all of you. So, one year. Technically, it's tomorrow. Technically, one year is tomorrow. 
So we uploaded the first five videos. I went live with five videos on February 27th last year. And here we are today. Had a very, very, very selfish goal that we'd be at 30,000 subscribers today. Well, I, that goal, I created that goal like earlier last week. But we are 54 subscribers short of that right now. We're going to look at some of my old builds, some of my old farms to start the stream, and then we might get into some of the achievement stuff. Um, let's see. Lurking's the best. Smitty, how's it going? Luis, what's happening? Mark, how's it going? Uh, FS Timelapse, sorry for the deleted message. I need to fix the... I need to fix the, uh, the bot that does that. A little too aggressive. I don't know what I was thinking when I set that up. So, just don't do all caps, and you'll be good. All right, let's jump into the game. Um, that looks wrong. That looks wrong. No cam? There's the cam. Okay, there we go. So, we're going to start pre- Farming Sim SWU. So this is on Franken Month, and uh, let me get chat. Let me get chat all sorted out here. I, I hit a button, so it's not scrolling now. And I'm gonna move it a little bit, cause there we go. There we go. Lurking, love, the, love your background. Thank you. Okay. Now let's get in it. Okay, so this is Franken Month, and this was my first um, YouTube series on Farming Simulator. It was on the Socks Way Up channel. I have unlisted those videos at this point because they were trash. I had no idea what I was doing in the game. I just knew I loved the game already and created this farm. Let's jump in this mode first. You can see all the land we own. So field 12... Field 11 here, 23 in this little custom field. This was a pretty fun playthrough. So this is mine, that's mine. We got some alfalfa out here. This was the first map and I'm really sad because I had a save of what this was gonna turn into when it was done and it looks so different than this, but just kind of taking a little a little glimpse into the, into the past here. Let's see some of our equipment. John Deere 7810, huh? And a Fent wrap. Like, I don't even remember this equipment. I don't even remember it. Up socks all the way up. Yes. Yes, I was. Ricky was just playing for three hours. Heck yeah. When's the next episode of Whiskey RP? Ooh. Ooh. There's going to be a mega of that. Look at all this alfalfa that I never wrapped. There's going to be a mega of that, uh, the finale. And I haven't started filming it yet. It's, uh, I'm kind of scripting it. It's going to be, it's going to be a major finale. So you can see we're using the top liner here. We don't use that that often anymore. We had a nice little green greenhouse set up here with a lot of, uh, looks like tomatoes that we needed to sell. There's our truck. This is, this has been in multiple videos and multiple series because it's the exact truck I drive in real life the exact truck uh, I think it's down to the year the exact truck too if I remember let's take a look uh, yeah 2019 that is the one uh, let's see yeah that's a pretty good pretty good trailer green cart there there's our flower our, our grain mill our flower building we have this here is this a regular silo I think it is I was thinking it was like a grass drying one, but I think that's a regular silo. And this was the silo for the grain mill. Makes you wonder, yeah, it makes you wonder what you were doing. It absolutely does. Like, look at this right here. Like a, like I pulled a Nate right here. We got a little bit of a mismatch of, of a, oh, is it the same crop at least? It just was harvested. Yeah, I don't know what happened there. And this is our house. There's our puppy Spartan. Yep, yep. Our spreader, our sprayer. 
We got a nice little auger wagon over here. Or forage wagon. Little forage wagon here. Oh, now we're stuck. Oh, we're stuck. This tractor here, ah, dude's far. I remember getting this in this playthrough. It was like 70% off on sale. It's our uh, cedar there. Our planter. Is it a planter or a cedar? I think that's a cedar. And our cutting equipment, our plow. Little uh, tether right there. Yeah. This was our workshop. Yeah. Loving it. Let's see. Yeah, there's our there's our wind rower. But yeah, this little thing looks somewhat familiar for people that are, you know, familiar with our series. It's the same pack as the the cow barn in Cattle Ranch or yes, Cattle Ranch, but uh, a different size. Uh, so we did have cattle on this series and then we had this barn over here that I thought was pretty sweet uh, just to store our hay and straw and apparently our seeds. Yeah, apparently our seeds were stored there too. Um, yeah, what else is there? I think that's about it on this map. So we're going to be doing a lot of like loading, I guess, today. And showing some secret sauce. We'll, we'll do what we can on this, uh, this mod pack and then uh, go from there. And I'll have to restart the game after that. So the next one I wanted to show is on the same map. It doesn't go in chronological order because I want to stay on the same mod pack. Weird seeing so many in game mods compared to what it is now with finding all the old equipment and stuff. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Seen, use it. Yeah, there wasn't a lot of mods in that playthrough. Um, the truck was probably, well, let me rephrase that. There wasn't a lot that most mods were from Mod Hub in that playthrough. And then I, I grabbed that Chevy truck because I had to have the real life the IRL truck. Wraiths? Is that how you say it? Wraiths? How's it going? Mayonnaise? Andrew, what's happening? Brandon and I are due. You're Astros fans? He doesn't like the Diamondbacks, but he wanted he wanted to, they to know. <laughs> that's, that's awesome. That is awesome. Well, I'm sorry you're Astros fans. Andrew, how's it going? Tell oh, Brandon I said hi. Uh, this is um, from our first championship in Farm Simulator. This is the the farm build that won uh, because of all of you that voted. It was amazing. Brody, happy back in the day. Thanks for hosting that. But I wanted to do like an actual walkthrough of it. Um, yeah. I've watched you since the start. Seen you know, all your videos. That's awesome, Navy. Hey, am I saying that right, Navy? Watching you from the hospital, my girlfriend has a lot, had a bit of a fall. Oh, no. Oh, broke wrist. That's not too bad then. That could have been a lot worse, I imagine. Yeah, I hope she recovers real quickly there. Yeah, so let's uh, let's jump in the sky for this, too. We'll do that. We'll get a little field of view improvements and flight mode. And the guys make fun of me because I don't go into this mode to do that. I like to just do the commands up here because I find them quicker. So yeah, that was the house. So the inspiration here was um, from a picture of the land that I own now and what the farm used to look like. Uh, the house is obviously is not exactly the same. Uh, it's uh, obviously the best I could find for farming simulator, but there's a house right here. There's a barn with four bays in it. This one was close enough. And there was a decent sized barn back here where this one is. The shape of this barn is pretty exact to the one but the scale of it it's a little smaller than the original barn was ginormous the silos were not here um i just did that for whoops oh we're stuck i did that to make it a little bit prettier my favorite thing about this is some of the detail work we did i'm trying not to make people sick by by flying through things i think i have the field of view a little too close let's do like 50. But yeah, like the detail work here, I felt like it was pretty awesome. And then added a little bit of shelving, shelving in here. I don't know if I showed that on the farm competition video, but that was pretty, that was pretty sweet. And a little bit of detailing over here. 
and the floating steps there, the ladder. And yep, gotta have gotta have that. So that's that. That's that one I wanted to look at. The next one we're gonna look at is somewhat of a spoiler to people that might be new to to the channel. Um, but we're gonna take a look at the new lands, the current state of it. The supercut will be out. I think it's three weeks from now, three or two weeks from now. Uh, but let's see, new lands, and oh yeah, we always I haven't fixed this in the save. There is a mod I have to disable. Uh, it is disabled. Okay, so we should be able to start. It auto disabled it for me. That's right. Brandon also wanted to ask if you would consider doing an apple orchard or something. He loves apple juice. I might mix it in there. I, I know Brendan and I discovered that, Brendan, uh, happy, discovered that when we were doing the Brothers series and the map that we were using had the apple orchard mod in it. And I'm pretty sure, I don't, Brendan's probably deep in an eye race right now, but I don't remember if he had to extract that to um, to get us to be able to have it on on last chance. So I'll have to look into that. But I I like the idea of an apple orchard. The um, the property that I live on used to have a ton of apple trees. My brother-in-law lives across the street, and on his property he planted. I want to say it was 24 apple trees last year. So in a couple years, that'll be pretty sweet. We have three that are still alive and we get a ton of apples from it every year. Michelle, how's it going? Teddy, how's it going? David, what's happening? The reason we were in the barn at this hour was because we were... Okay. All right, so this is also, in my opinion, a disappointment of a build. And we're fixing that this year. So that's why the supercuts have come out for New Lands. I'm getting back to that series and we're gonna blend it with, it'll be the next season of SWU Farm Rescue. I'm going out this way to be dramatic apparently. Uh, just won the race never been in a car or track you still won by five seconds okay sat on the pole by two seconds had only five apple orchard mod is separate from the map is it i thought you had to pull it out of it i i, I guess i didn't know congratulations on your win i still have never won one in iRacing. racing so this this series was planned to be like long like I wanted this series to last a long time and we were just getting started on it when I stopped recording episodes. I've learned so much about this game since we stopped making these episodes. And a lot of the reasons I stopped recording it was because a lot of the multiplayer recordings started getting in the way and didn't have a lot of time to balance with that. Thought my mic shut off okay so yeah so we're gonna do like a farm rescue mix so the idea everyone is here gets you know a little sneak peek of what's gonna happen is these episodes stopped and i went on the character in this series went on an adventure of rescuing other farms and did two seasons and then this will be the third one but then comes home and it's like this farm sucks it's it, and it's not even like the farmyard is non-existent. The the fields, like the shape of this field is 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 terrible in my opinion. I love this series. I'm starting to watch it all right recently. Nice. Hello, Frankie. Um so yeah, so a lot of improvements are gonna come to this. And I I can't wait to start recording that, but I, I have a method to my madness on the slow rollout of the of the supercuts and once supercut threes out i will start recording the fourth year on this and I'm, I'm hoping to do it pretty big so it'll be pretty exciting 
we have some so this is a sneak peek for people that are just watching the supercuts and didn't watch the actual episodes the actual episodes are out there uh if you finished year two's supercut you would want to start with episode 17. So episodes one through eight were, were year one, episodes nine through 16 were year two, and then episodes 17 through 26 are gonna be year three with an extra month in there just to get us caught up. Uh, let's look at some equipment here too. So this is what we started with. We still have it on the playthrough, so no spoilers there, really. Uh, that will stay around for the entirety of the series. Uh, we hop out here we have this massey ferguson still we have a good little pottinger planter that's a cedar right we have the sprayer a lot of this is also some default mods so that's some of the things that we'll be mixing up when we when we revisit it we have the cultivator here the spreader we have the john deere square baler it's a great mod that is a great mod a tiny little grain cards and our auto loading trailer there yeah, so many ideas here, and I've learned a lot about terraforming and building placement. And so those were some of the big mistakes that I think I made. As you can see, the, the land probably should have got terraformed a little better before putting down these pastures here. And these greenhouses, uh, it just drove me nuts. Drove me nuts. I really wish you could have sloped ground and sloped buildings on Farming Simulator, at least some type of sloping. I think a beehive would be great in that map setup. It would be, yeah. You also have, if I also add my, if I may add apples, add. Oh, apple whiskey. Yeah. Oh man, I'm super, I'm super interested, Brendan. What a, <laughs> what a, what's the, what map or what track were you racing on? This is this the, the map name is Newlands. It is on Mod Hub, and you can see here I started getting into trying to do detailing on the builds, and you know made it to where we took out some of the ground here and left the we got to the rock bed, and I just don't like it. I still I think I could have done so much better. The 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 big hiccup here on this playthrough was was money right trying not to cheese anything and actually use the money that's in the account to do the terraforming, to do the buildings and the placements of details and everything like legitimately. It's hard when you're playing. Oh, let's stop time. When you're when you're playing to uh, do a rags to riches and money matters, right? And so I never got around to fixing the terraforming here, which is just terrible. Like we're going to be better here too. That's I think that's what I'm trying to trying to say and there's a little spoiler here and i kind of wish i didn't do it because there was a skinny field right here that i just loved i liked the little tiny field and then having the separate one that combined them mtr what's happening oh you've already been commenting i'm silly is it possible to buy mods on console no i don't i whatever is whatever you can download is what you have access to from what i understand i don't know any of the hacks of getting custom mods onto console. Formula V, oh, you did a road course, huh? And you won by five seconds? Man, that's awesome. Emily, how's it going? The maple tree is good too. Oh yeah, 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 we have that in Whiskey RP, the maple tree mod, I think that's what you're referring to. But yeah, so this, uh, yeah, this playthrough, I can't wait to get back into it. I think it's going to be sweet. I've been trying out open racing, open wheel. Oh, yeah, it is pretty fun. I don't have the patience for it. I've tried. I've tried. Um, it takes a lot of uh, muscle memory. Big props to people that can do those road courses really well. Let's see, what else is there to talk about? Let's jump into... Um, I don't know if that works on this mod pack. We're going to have to switch mod packs here. We'll switch cameras or scenes to 
Oh, why does it do that? Camera does not like that. So I'm using FSG Mod Assistant to change mod packs. Um, what do we want to go to next? Uh, that doesn't exist anymore. Uh, you know what? We have one more on that mod pack. I'm going to show some spoilers for the upcoming um, Cattle Ranch videos. And you know what? I would love some feedback, too. What's now, the name of the, song, of the song that's being played right now? Um, let's switch. We can switch to this now. It should be up there in the top. But it is called Road Trippy by Harris Heller by Stream Element or Stream Beats. Uh, back here. So we're gonna go into the Cattle Ranch save file. Um, you'd think I'd know exactly where that was. Right there. Bye Medic! How's it going? Are we where I wanna be? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We wanna be right here. There we go. Alright, spoilers! Once it loads, this one takes a minute. Can we get to 30,000 subs? That'd be awesome. It would be awesome. We're 49 away. James, how's it going? Really enjoy your videos. They are very relaxing after work before bedtime. That's exactly what I'm going for. Thanks. I like the relaxing. I like the chill atmosphere. I give a lot of credit to um, a very, not very well known Twitch streamer uh, named KRX. And he did City Skylines. He's he's kind of gone away from City Skylines at this point and just does a lot, just a lot of different games. Uh, but his style of, of uh, interacting with chat and the way he talks to to people is is really what I'm going for. Uh, let's go over here to start. You got a little spoiler there. I built a town that was actually relevant to the, or the town <coughs> which fitted on the map really well. Nice. So we added a few though. Let's, let's fly a little faster than that. Let's move a little faster than that. There we go. So we have a custom grain mill which is a little spoiler for everyone. So we, we get cattle ranch. We're making some we're making some flour. We have a sweets bakery that makes some interesting items. One of them that, that it, it makes me laugh because it's very clear that this mod wasn't made by anyone who is anywhere close to America. Um, has anybody had grape bread before? I, I, I'm just kind of interested chat. Has anybody had grape bread? Dad Wolf just found your videos recently, and they are the best around. Thank you. That means a lot to me. That means a lot. Thank you. Um, yeah, grape bread. So it's raisin bread. You can make croissants. You can make cakes, chocolate bread. I'm sure a lot of people have seen that that mod before. And then back here we have... I was going to do a custom building here, but I got lazy. So we're going to make some oil as well. Uh, so the big change is the farmyard area which was up here and you can see it's in the process of really changing. I mean, is grape bread a real thing or is it just raisin bread, right? Like, am I crazy? It's just called raisin bread. It's made out of raisins, right? Uh, so yeah, the, the sheds are gone and it's not a complete spoiler because the design's not complete. It's kind of it's kind of done up here, but it's not, it hasn't been done in game. But this is something I've been really struggling with the look of it. So the terrain change was so huge right here. And you can see this equipment um, is kind of actually pretty awesome. I'll show it off here in a little bit. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Let's hop back out. So uh, this cliff side here, I think one of the things I need to adjust is with the paint texture of adding rocks to it. It's a little excessive. It's a little excessive. Um, but you can see the terrain difference over here. It doesn't slope well. And again, because the game doesn't allow you to slope um, buildings, you have to you have to flatten everything. And it, it was unfortunate that it had to go that low to get it flat. I find these videos help me in the game. I, that's awesome, darling. 
Yeah, it's Raisin Bird. Absolutely. Um, are you doing a new map or just showing different lands? My first live stream. Yeah, I'm kind of recapping the last year of videos and um, and then we'll get we'll get into some gameplay here in a little bit. But I think yeah, there's like probably two or three more maps I want to kind of selfishly go over. Wish I had more stuff like zucchini. A more prominent, yeah, some vegetables. Great bed does not exist. Great bed does exist? Interesting. Is it made out of grapes or is it made out of raisins? Uh, but yeah, so that's what we're going for here. We have this huge setup. You can see the, um, if you if you know the series well, the processing plant or processing silo for the TMR and the solid fertilizer is uh, been moved from, from over there to here. Closer proximity to the fields. Uh, went with this huge, ridiculous ego, egoistical, ego, 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 I don't know what word I'm looking for there. Setup of silos here, or bins, and uh, this is something that is going to change very soon in this series. I got rid of the fences here so that I could just drive through. Started uh, adjusting some mods myself. I mean, grapes are. <laughs> Great raisins are grapes. Grapes are not raisins. Grapes become raisins. So, my question is, are they dried prior to cooking? Or are they still... I don't know. Apparently, grape bread is a thing, and it's completely different from raisins. See, that's that was my question. So, yeah, there's a the little spoilers there. You know, we got these fields, this huge field. This is actually, like, we, the video at the very beginning of the stream was harvesting this field. Um, I love working in this ginormous field with the with the forest in the middle there. And the slaughterhouse has been moved over here as well. And there's a, a bunch of sheds. As many as we can fit in here with it still looking good is the next step here. Grandma made it. Are there any wood or steel columns you could add? Oh, that's an interesting idea. Yeah, I, originally I was looking for, and I might, I mean, I've recorded a lot and it's, it'll be in a lot of the content, but I was looking for more retaining wall type things and went with rocks like, Brendan and I talked about that, and, and Nate, we talked about that for a while before I actually did it. We're looking for Black Mountain, Montana. This game, do, 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 do. Um, sugarcane, poplar, uh, additional decoration package. Uh, that's, yeah, that's the one that's going to make me want to switch. All right, we'll switch to the Whiskey RP mod pack. And I think that'll be the last one we show and then we'll hop into we'll hop into game. I might show off Brendan, is that server still running? Rezcore from the Discord. Oh, how's it going? Railroad ties. Oh. Do they have those in game? Awesome. Yeah, I might jump into that and kind of show that off here in a minute, even though my video is not live yet. Never played Farm Sim before, but I really like your playthroughs. Jeremy, thank you. Um, oh, the camera's disabled. We're just talking. We're just talking to blank space. I don't know why when I switch, it must be a different um, resource in OBS. Interesting. Oh, uh, Blue Knight, it's not as consistent as I want it to be. Um, but yeah, we I do stream every once in a while, and I'm trying to get more consistent with it. Monday nights is definitely when it will happen, when I am consistent, and then potentially very, very soon will be uh, probably a midday, like Saturday is what I'm thinking. Uh, let's see, yep, Black Mountain, Montana. Let's hop in here and take a look. Kind of talk through some of my my thoughts there. Hellwolf, how's it going? 
Music's just a little too loud. Yeah, I can fix that. Oh, it is a little too loud for sure. Oh, right there is probably better, right? No, I, I, Alex, I think it's because um, I, I have. <laughs> It's the same OBS set, it said, uh, same OBS configurations from when I used to stream on Twitch like three years ago. And I think it's uh, a different uh, resource for the camera. So they're two different resources. So only one can be active at the same time. So it is a little, a little weirdness of OBS for sure. Oh yeah, no spoilers. I really want to talk about this, but I don't want to spoil it. Oh man, so some stuff's going to happen. I'll be, I'll, I'll warn you right now, the last year of of uh, whiskey rp or the last the last videos of it they're going to be very dramatic there's going to be a lot of drama lots of drama and to be honest with you i haven't been on the save file since since i finished recording the um the broken building why did i start youtube and Why did I start? Um. Well, actually, it's actually a pretty easy answer. The the I I liked I like video I love video games and my original thought was for a variety channel and that's what I'm gonna try to do with the Socks Way Up channel long term and get way more into the live stream aspect of it and i started on twitch and it was I'm trying to remember i want to say it was like november of 2019 when i first started going live and um i started then flirting with the idea of could we go and make YouTube videos too? And I, I liked the idea and kind of fell into the trap of some content creators out there that just repost streams, like edit it down. And I was I was thinking about going that route originally to just to really drive traffic from YouTube to Twitch. And I think my entire mentality on that was backwards at the time. And I tried to go live on Twitch. There's some reason the multi the multi output mod is not working for me. It was just a blank screen on Twitch again. But anyways, um, and so I was updating. Good night, Hellwolf. I was updating. Oh, words are hard. I uploaded a couple of videos to YouTube about City Skylines, and that was the game I was streaming a lot at the time. And then I just got burnt out because the growth on, on Twitch was rough. It was super rough, and it, I would I would be streaming to maybe two or three people at the max um, for like six months or so. Actually, I think it was way before November of 2019 because that's way too close to COVID. So then I, I uploaded a few videos. I uploaded a, one like tutorial video on City Skylines, and I walked away. I walked away from YouTube. I walked away from Twitch, and one day. Um, one day I I checked my my stats on on YouTube and a couple of those videos actually had like 5000 views on the Socks Way Up channel and so I was like maybe maybe this is what I should do um and so I I doubled down on that and I I got into City Skylines content and I did pretty consistently for about a year and a half um City Skylines I did software ink videos which is a, a game where you it's a, it's a simulator of running a software company uh, that's what i do in real life so i always thought that was awesome some nano 1800 was in there um a couple other games i post videos on and today i posted a supermarket uh, simulator video today on that channel so i'm getting back into it um but yeah so that's what started it and then I fell in love with the editing process and everyone thinks I'm so weird for it. Um, let's make it a little, a little better time of day. There we go. Uh, yeah, I fell in love with the editing process. And so I, I liked recording and then trying to make it as entertaining as possible with the editing. And I've gotten a lot better 
um, I know where, where I want to be. Like I have goals and I've, I've see people's videos and I want to be able to do certain things. And if, and when we go full time, um, I don't want to say our content will change cause I don't think it will change. I think I found what I really like making, but I, it'll, the, um, the quality of the, uh, the presentation of the content will change a little bit. Uh, this is my favorite grass field. I mean, I just love it. It, it feels like it's something that was uh, maintained and kept. Obviously we kept it for, for product for around the farm, but just to have like grass and maybe you have a dog or two that just love running around on it. Luna, you found me on accident. Looking for videos for FS22 to ran and got hooked. It's awesome. Hey man, I have, haven't had a whole lot of time to watch your content, but it's super busy. I hope it's also well. Kyle, no worries. That's another reason why I like YouTube better than Twitch is uh, people are busy and the videos are always there for when you have time. Um, yeah. Definitely. Um, yeah, so I fell in love with, with editing, really, and I wanted to make a lot of, a lot of content and... Um, how did I become like, we need, we just need to switch one. So let's use, let's leave that. That screen's fine, right? That's fine. Um, we're going to go into a make, oh, I called it makeover. So there's a video I'm editing. If you've seen Brody's video, we did a farm, uh, makeover or like a farm flip video. And I thought it was pretty sweet. I am going to, um, go to this one nope not that one we are going to go to the full cam for a second because i i know the passwords and stuff but i don't like exposing public servers i've been laid off a bit so caught up oh i'm sorry you got laid off a wise man once said city skylines remastered looks good city skylines remastered looks good have you played um city skylines 2 is that what you're talking about I like strategy games. I like simulation games a lot, though. Oh, good. This was the last server I was in. So yeah, I don't remember the password. Do we get to see your build from farms? Yes, you do. Um, So I have the like finishing the story and how the this channel got created. I had of the um, like EAs, or at the time it was called, um, oh, I forget what they used to be called. The like pass to play all of like the EA games and um, the Sims and stuff. And Farm Dynasty, the Farmer's Dynasty was on that. And I started playing that and found that it was pretty much a dead game. I got into Victoria too. My PC can't. So I played Farmer's Dynasty and decided at at that time that I, I really liked the farming game. And so, in part of this this move, to, we moved from Arizona to Michigan in 2022, and um, growing up in Phoenix being around or not really phoenix in the west valley of phoenix in the glendale area uh there's a there's a lot of farming when i was younger but i wasn't interested in it at all and then i'm not even showing you the map <laughs> um but as I, i've gotten older uh, the importance of agriculture has become more and more obvious to me as a person and and the um the technology that goes into it and the time and the effort and the respect that I have for for the people that do that in real life is has become huge. And we've moved to a small town in uh, the upper peninsula of Michigan, and we have a good amount of acres on our property and a lot of farms around us and a ton of farmers around us. And and so that culture has, has been like my lifestyle culture has changed big time. And so I was super in interested in farming, and that's why I started playing Farming Simulator because I was I wanted to learn more about it. To be honest, I'm a, I'm a gamer, so if there's a game that simulates something in real life, 
I'm going to do it. And so in this journey, I've also started researching and learning more about that stuff outside of the game. But so I started doing that on the Socks Way Up channel, and that was that first map we showed on Franken Month, and realized that I will not stop playing this game. Um, so we, yeah, so I, I, I started, I, I think it was like 37 episodes or something on the, the playthrough on the Socks Way Up channel. I was just busting those out and all I wanted to do was play Farming Simulator. So I started another channel because it wasn't growing on that channel. And that's the thing about don't go bucks. That is a terrible thing to say in my chat. That is the worst thing you can say in my chat. Um, I'll get to that in a second. But so I was getting like 30 views, 45 views a video. And at the time, my City Skylines videos were getting like 200, 300. So it was very clear to me that YouTube just wasn't a fan of, or YouTube couldn't figure out who to push the content to. I'm going to look really silly with my beanie right now because my ears are bothering me. Um, yeah, so that's that's what caused me to create this channel is I knew that if I started fresh with no subscribers, I didn't tell any friends about this channel. So the algorithm would definitely be friendly to me as in um, it's going to push it to people that want to watch farming content and not push it to people that want to watch City Skylines content or anything else or software ink content. Um, so a little YouTube insight there. Uh, and yeah, no, I'm not a I'm not a big Michigan sports fan. Um, my wife's born and raised in this town that we live in now, but I'm forever I'm forever from Arizona. Arizona is my blood, so I am a huge Suns fan. I would say that is the first sports team that I cared about at all. That um, basketball was probably. Baseball is really my first love, but we didn't have a team when I was young. Uh, I, I didn't uh, get to experience the Arizona Diamondbacks until I was like 16. Might have been like 14. Um, so yeah, the you no, know, we don't talk about the Bucks. It's pretty, it's a pretty touchy subject in the last four years or so for Suns fans. Brandon's grandmother lives in Michigan near the Sioux. Now you really got this, his attention. See, and I'm still trying to learn all of the lingo up here. Is that Seuss, Saint Sue? Hold on. Sue locks? Sault Ste. Marie is it like near Canada. So we're we're only like three hours away from there. That is the place you're talking about, Andrew. Um, man, it's all you. You inspire me with the SWU to get No Man's Land and build my own. Blue Knight, that is awesome. I'm a Michigan State fan, though, because my grandfather was Michigan State fourth national. That's awesome. See, that's a legit reason to. Uh, Yes, Sue Saint, Sue Saint Marie. Yeah, that's uh, maybe two hours from here. It's either two, two or three hours from where I'm at. We're in Delta County, where we are in uh, near Escanaba. Yeah, so Brendan did amazing with this. Um, I think, gosh, at this point it was about a month ago when we started this build and talking about it. John, you live in Arizona. But you're from Michigan, so we swapped. Can't do the snow. See, and I'm the opposite. I can't do the 120 degree days anymore, or the 115 degree days. Uh, so yeah, so Brendan did pretty awesome with this. Um, see, McClary, none of none of that none of that sentence makes any sense. I'm from the great state of Ohio. I'm confused by that sentence to begin with. And we're massive Bucks fans. My mom went to Mount Union and my dad went to trade school in Cleveland. What does that have to do with Milwaukee?
Youpers. Sorry, it's with a Y O O P E R. Why? I, I don't know. That's just the way they do it. Your stats are Brendan miss stuff. You know what's funny? If you if if you saw the original build, like no offense, Brendan, if you're still here, the original build was was a little bit better. It, there's not a lot of differences, but it was. There's something about recording and trying to get things done, where things just don't come together like they do when we took our time doing this design. Um, this thing over here. Yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I figured you'd agree. Um, I'm not like I would say I'm about 80% satisfied with this. It was, it, it, it it's, gosh, we'll see how I edit the video, but I, I enjoy farmyards and it was nice to. Okay, so to be honest, the pressure of trying to have something look as good as this over here, while while he's working on that and I'm over here working on this and I'm just like, oh man, this looks like crap. While he's making this and I'm I'm making this look like crap. It's a lot of pressure. So I, I, I did some of the fun little I love landscape detail. And I think in real life driving up to a, a barn like this with that around it would be awesome. You know, maintaining as much grass as you can out here just to I like grass. So I'm from probably because I'm from Phoenix and it's it's not, it's, not, it's hard to maintain grass there. Okay, so that's even dumber. Like, I'm, I like, maybe I'll lose some fans, but I don't like Ohio State to begin with. Like, how many names does does your college need? Like, you can't be the Bucks if you're the Buckeyes. The Bucks are something else. You can't the Ohio State. Yeah, I mean, does anybody else want to be Ohio State other than Ohio State? I don't know. I've never been a fan of anything Ohio, so. Like, I don't know. I think they have really good potholes there, I think is what I've I've known. Oh, with Dan Marley, that got my attention. I remember when Barkley signed. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. From Yeah, well, Barkley tr was traded, wasn't he? But I, I was super young when that happened. But yeah. Grandma went to Notre Dame. See, I didn't even read this whole thing. Yeah, Ohio's like... Nothing happens in Ohio. <laughs> I don't... It's just so funny. Like, even being from Arizona and, like... And so when I was around 17 or 18 and college was starting to be a topic, there was um, Arizona State University, which I'm not a huge fan of. But there were... Um, you know, they're, they're in competition with Ohio State for like the top two party schools in the US. And if that's what you want to be known as, it's, it's not it's not a great reputation. <laughs> the is a flyover state. No, no kidding. Ohio State needs a thousand names to make up for the shame that is Cincinnati. <coughs> Excuse me. You went. I went to Arizona once, and I almost died because of the heat. It, it is. It is pretty hot, but it's, it's not. Not that bad. It's not almost die unless you're. Heat strokes are a real thing, but it, it, you, it's almost got to be intentional. Or. Most of the time when you hear about people having heat strokes because they went on a long hike during the winter or during the summer and didn't have enough uh, water with them or didn't prepare correctly. Ohio is a state you drive through to get somewhere else. <laughs> I guess I started something there. Texas is a real state, according to my boy Brandon. Is the real state. Um, It's a huge state. Uh, I like things about Texas. But yeah, so this is, uh, yeah, I still got to edit this video and figure out when I'm going to release it. But I think it would be fun to play on this. Um, do you, so do you still do role play as well? Yeah, um, we do. Um, we have that series Uncharted right now that is with Nate and Brendan. And then there's a series 
called Good Times. We haven't been putting the names in. I gotta start. I'm gonna. I might. dead now i'm not going to college so it shouldn't matter but operations you know. wrestling is interesting yeah emily that's my opinion on it too like number not gonna get into it i think brody just summed it up pretty well it is a sport it's just not entertaining and i'm not talking about ww wwe and and all that talking about like high school college mat wrestling um did we harvest all of this harvested harvested did we harvest all of the olives i guess the map would tell us so we're jumping back into my um insanity of wanting to that didn't really show us let's do this um, let's shut. I, I wish you could like click on this twice to have only. And then it says ready to harvest, but if I go over here, okay, so they are ready to harvest. So we have in here 12,000 liters. So I have a really weird, um, obsession with getting all the achievements in this game and and balancing the difference between cheating them and actually doing them ready to harvest. So did we, did we do one row? And why is it so hard to see what's going on here? Okay, so I think the second row is ready. Is it the same on this side too? Um, and I, I, I don't remember the amount, I'd have to pull up a page, but we have to harvest a lot, a lot of olives and sell them. So we could just, you know, fill up the grain cart and sell olives. But I wanted to at least pretend like we're trying to do. Okay, those are harvested.
sports have turned into part of the entertainment industry and you don't get entertained from it, there's no point. Yeah, there you go. Unfortunately, I believe that the case for most states. Yeah, I agree, Jeff. I agree. Uh, well, happy you know what's in. Uh, McCleary, you're, you're dead wrong on that. You are dead wrong on that. I can understand why people would say that baseball is boring, but I don't understand why. Why? Um, I'm a big fan of the, ch the rule changes that MLB has made to make uh, baseball way more entertaining. Um, we're going to the end. I'm, I'm struggling with uh, actually playing right now, apparently. I think that, okay, so I, I talk a lot of trash sometimes, but the reality is everyone's going to like what they like, and there's nothing wrong with that, including Cincinnati and Cleveland. There's a third C? What's the third C? All right, there we go. This one can get harvested. Let's put that in cruise control. I didn't set up the steering wheel because I'm lazy. I think hockey would be right up there with other sports if they got rid of offsides. Same thing with soccer. I think it ruins the sport. I don't think it makes it better. It's like people saying boxing is a sport. Boxing is not a sport. It's all about beating the crap out of people. It is a fun debate. Um, like I said, I got... I was in the gym, I was in the locker room getting ready for a basketball game and you know, basketball and wrestling in high school are, are the same time of year. And I, I flat out, his name's Russell. I don't remember Russell's last name. I probably could if I tried, but I told Russell, you know, wrestling's not a real sport and um, I almost passed out from a headlock. And we're actually pretty decent friends. Um, so I was a little winded before the game. So. Are they tough? Uh, yeah. Is it entertaining? No. Yeah, I think it's a little, it's a little more. It was not Russell Wilson. It's a little more than, uh, more than that that goes to why people dislike Ohio. And I don't know anything about that. I, there's, there's a lot about history I choose to, uh, ignore because uh, it does no good for anybody because people just ignore it like like me people are refusing to learn from it and I'm going to get off that topic right now hockey has the best fights though I remember being a kid and playing like PlayStation 1 or 2 and the NHL game the best part was like getting in a fight and you throw your gloves off and you'd like it was so cool headlocks not illegal in the locker room when there's no coaches around that's just stupid choice of words in front of the wrong audience is what it was for me it looks like this was harvested too so we must have harvested most of this last time I'm watching you harvest grapes, drinking grape juice, and making tomato sauce. Well, I'm harvesting olives, technically. Someone who agreed with you, with me, I think history is a waste of time. I think there's a balance between a waste of time and it's important, but it's not a topic I like to get into on, on this channel. I remember watching Goon, the hockey movie, and it was pretty good. 
Did I harvest? Like, I don't remember that, Alex, because that one row wasn't, it said it was ready to be harvested, so we might skip some time here. The thing that's confusing to me about the achievements is if it's, um, see, ready to harvest. So is it this last row? I've never done olives. This is the only time I've ever done them is for this achievement. So I see them in there. So it must just be that last row. And is it just on the back side? Hop. Ha, tricked it. Okay, so yeah, it is. Nobody saw that, right? Can I get out of this? Oh, come on. We're taking liberties. Because it's the one year anniversary. I think it's pretty cool. I've made it pretty consistent for a year. I, you know, I don't remember. I've done olives, but I'm gonna give it a go on my current. I've never done. Yeah, I. I don't like. I think it's the fact that we only have like two or three implements and harvesters and stuff to choose from, to where. Especially as a content creator, it's like, what's there to mix up and make unique to get people to watch your videos? Because let's be honest, at this point I am trying to get people to watch the videos. It's not 100% just because I enjoy it. I do enjoy it, but you know, you know what I mean. We got a new member and I didn't even notice. So I'm sorry to anybody. I don't, let me see if I can figure that out. To whoever did that, let me see which tab I need open. I didn't see it in chat, but I see it in the analytics. So whoever that membership was, thank you. Weird. Okay. Um, it might be time to shift the steering wheel over here. Let me get some things out of my way. Move the keyboard back a little bit. Well, Jeff, I do have a pretty good day job, but I would like to, I would like this to be my, my day job. Corey, thank you. Oh, was it Andrew? Nice. He still wants to buy a t-shirt or your logo on it. Yeah, we're we're working on that. There's um uh try to trying to um we're working on a way. There's a few of us working on a way to do the merch without having to rip people off. Uh it's really important to me to find a way to make it affordable for people and not feel tempted to price gouge because of all the services out there the way they they work you know they get they're able to buy stuff at um at whole cost you know wholesale cost and then they're reselling it to us they're printing it for us and then we have to mark it up to even break even so there's there's something in the works that i'm pretty excited about it might just take time but we will definitely have merch soon on this channel and and as affordable as possible is my plan not gonna make it to the end of this row. That's right. That's why we made that. That's why we made that, that break. Uh... Oh man, Darwin, just keep pushing. Just keep pushing. You'll get views. Make every video better. That's the goal. That is the uh, the focus that I try to have. I definitely lose that focus every once in a while. But that is absolutely the best advice is just keep pushing, keep trying to make every video better. If you can, if you can stomach it, don't look at analytics for a while and then go back and, and look at analytics like maybe once a week. Uh, that was the first reason why I quit the first time is because I was on my phone just 
refresh, refresh, refresh. How many views? Refresh, refresh. And it was, it got super, super, super excessive. Oh yeah, Andrew, and based on, uh, I don't like, I just don't like talking about things until they're official, um, like the actual details of it, but the way we're going to do this, stuff like that would absolutely be po possible, um, whether we charge a little bit extra because of the person making it is definitely gonna, needs to get taken care of. Um, to like customize things would be sweet. I think like uniform jerseys or something would be sweet with names on them. Or like a exclusive, uh, only 10 people get a certain type of t-shirt or beanie or hat or something. We're going to make it to about right here, aren't we? Like, or 20% 20, 20 to go. Jerseys would be cool. Am I going to get FS25? I'm going to get my hands on FS25 as soon as I possibly can. Yeah. And the number could be their birthday. That would be cool. Oh, yeah. He sh Andrew, he should be bragging. That's a... That's a... Um, that's a tough thing, because... I, I, I honestly made, made a huge exception for that is something that I, I try to avoid because of um, the amount of people that do make requests like that or, or might. Um, I'll just, I'll give you a little insight on the way my, my brain and heart works is I read your comments and every single part of me was like, yes, we're doing this. So there was, there was no doubt in my, in my mind that it was the right thing to do. Um, I didn't, at that moment, didn't care if there was consequences from other people, you know, saying, why didn't you do that to me? Like, they're not really consequences, but like if, if someone else asked to be featured and I didn't feature them, it just, every, every part of me was compelled to agree with that. And I think it was well worth it. Mr. Bioroots, how's it going? Okay, so, uh, don't look. Okay, so we are right... Can we tell? We can tell. Okay. Where's our grain truck? I wish I could run this fast in real life. I don't... There hasn't even been confirmation that, uh... That FS25 is a game yet, right? Like, a lot of us are speculating that... That it will be towards the end of this year. Um, I know there's a few of us in our group that that is hoping it's not this year because they don't feel like they're done with the game. But I personally, because of algorithms and because of uh, um, the amount of people that are interested in games when they come out, especially new versions of games like this, uh, I, I want it to be this November or Q3, like late Q3. But I think if we do hear something, um, we've been speculating that it'll be around, is it May or May or April? April or May? Better AI would be nice. Um, even course play is pretty good, but I know you can't get that on console. So better AI definitely, I think would be a good priority for giants to focus on. You think it's April? Is that what we saw like the rest? Like we were comparing press releases the other night and trying to figure out like when we feel like we would know if we're gonna know this year. Um, as a software developer, I've, I've never made a major game, but I totally understand why companies wait until certain times to announce things. Cause I don't know. The marketing standpoint releasing this year would be a bad move in my opinion. There is zero work to at, there's zero work at promotion for it, so it seems like they're really trying to build the hype for it. So John, I, I, I agree with you when it comes to that for the most part. 
what I've seen um, in some other similar size studios like Colossal Order or Paradox, uh, who makes City Skylines, is they announced like, I want to say 60 days before the game came out that City Skylines 2 was being released and it was not ready. Um, if you want to see a united group of YouTubers, um, go find all the big City Skylines YouTubers and find their We Need to Talk About City Skylines 2 videos. It's sad. Um, I think there's also certain genres of video games where we've talked about this on the podcast. We talked about this on other lives is Giants is in a unique position and so is uh, Colossal Order and Paradox Interactive with City Skylines is they don't have real competition. You can say what you want about American farming. It's mobile until it's on PC. It's not a competitor. I've looked at some other farming games. They are not competitors and Giants doesn't need to promote. Would it make sense? Yes, absolutely. But I don't think they're I don't think they're, they're looking at it that way. Um, I think they know there's a lot of people like me. There's a lot of people like Grant, Nate, Buck, Pickle, Daggerwin, that uh, they'll do the promoting for them. <clears throat> I mean, Paradox has an entire dedicated team to City Skylines, so like I, I, like I could, I could talk for the next three hours about my extreme disappointment with Paradox. Yeah, Brendan, the other thing with, with that comment is um, things can change really fast in this industry and especially with um oh man it's such a crazy topic because it's gonna affect content creators really quick is that new product that um chat gpt and all of them are working on is their open ai um like my company when 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 open ai became a, a thing in chat gpt it was a very much a hard no we're not allowed to use that for software development to where now we have our legal departments doing a lot of research on it to decide if we can use it um and i bring this up because it's not going to take as long to make things as it used to it's not going to take as many humans to make things as it used to so it, it could be less than four to five years if somebody else decides to make a, a good farming game. Tony Hawk Pro Farmer. Wait, people are using AI to create... No, I'm saying it's not that far off is what my fear... Honestly, it is a fear. It's not an excitement. It is a fear of mine. Um, I want to look up this achievement. And I'm going to, like, three minutes, I'll be back.
<laughs> yeah, I muted again. We need 60,000 liters of olives. Um. Brody doesn't need an editor. He needs to watch a couple of videos I sent him and stop being lazy. Because, like, one of these days I'm going to do a... I'm going to do a live stream of my editing process. Um, oh, did I even check seasonal growth? Settings, settings, settings. Seasonal growth, no. Okay, so we're going to, so we have 17,000, we need 60,000. So if we do this again, that would be 34,000. So we need one, two, three, four. I think we need a lot more. I could do the math, but we're going to do seven more rows. And we did no fertilizer, if I remember right. No! Brendan knows exactly what I'm talking about, too. And I, you know, I, I do... So, AI editor, like, per se, isn't the thing. It's, um... What is it under? Orchards. It's, um... AI tools that help with editing and... Adobe has done an amazing job of adding them to their suite. There's basically my editing process today is record for X amount of time, right? Let's just say when it comes to the multiplayer stuff, when we record with Nate, we try to do, why aren't these snapping like they normally do? Um, we try to do about an hour and a half per episode so then you remux it so if anyone knows what i'm talking about in obs you have a setting where there's a certain file type that if you run out of uh space on your computer or your or obs crashes it'll save the file and if you do it as mp4 it will not so then you remux it into an mp4 after that and um davinci resolve has some awesome ai stuff too uh, and then, so you remux it, so that takes a little bit of time. And then I upload it to Adobe Premiere and I walk away for like 25 to 30 minutes, depending on how long the footage is, because I have to let the AI in Premiere Pro do its thing to track all of the words that are in the video. Once all those words are tracked and then you start editing. I do text-based editing is what I do. And when I'm feeling really lazy, I will use their feature that automatically deletes all the pauses. And it doesn't take very long, but it's not 100% bulletproof either. So I have to then go through and spend a good amount of time fixing pauses that are too short. Like if they... Um, They'll cut off words sometimes, like you'll be finishing a sentence and it'll cut it off, so you have to go fix that. So it definitely helps uh, the editing process. And honestly, I feel like I, I give Brendan a hard time, but my style and Brendan's style is not the same. So the way I edit might not work for what Brendan's looking for in his videos. And same with Alex. I'm... Well, Alex, you have someone editing for you. But if I would say when it comes to my time right now, it takes me about 50% of the time, 50% time to uh, to edit versus record. Like I would say if it's two hours of recording, it would be like maybe an hour of editing, maybe. But it's not free either. DaVinci Resolve, uh, some of their good features that I'm talking about are behind a paywall and it's their pro version. So it's a one-time fee. It's better than the, uh, it's better than the membership that Adobe has, but it's a one-time fee. I think it's like 300 bucks. Okay, so we did one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That should be plenty. That should be plenty. So they should be at the same growth stage, I think, right? Um, do we have a house? Da wanna gonna, how's it going? 
I'm over here just rambling. All right, so we didn't, I don't think we did fertilizer last time. Typically when I'm doing my own videos, a two hour recording would take me about 45 minutes to edit down. And even then it's very lazily. Yeah, when I don't add music, I can get an I can get an editing session done in like whatever the time. Like basically, if it's a 20 minute video, it would take me about 25 to 30 minutes to edit. And then adding the music, adding any montages or any time lapses is where it would uh, would it would add to it. Maybe tomorrow I'll work on a project to help get this achievement easier. Um, if, if you if you do that, um, I would say focus on the a project around grapes because the amount of olives that we have out here right now is going to get this done. But then we have to do cotton as well. Um, growth stage. Oh, those are going to be done first. Okay. FD36 captain, what's happening? We are working on an achievement. I'm achievement hunting still. At the beginning of the stream, I went through all of my like save files throughout the last year um, and a little bit beyond last year. And now we are working on an achievement to... What is this one called? I don't even know if I can pronounce it. Basically, you have to sell 60,000 liters of olives. So we have 17,000 liters now. We are skipping time letting the olives grow and be they should be ready to harvest here now. And it's going to be a lot of harvesting. Oh, where did all this equipment come from? So if I remember right, we're going to start from over here. We take a break at that gap, unload, and then we continue and come back and unload. So I believe we had it in a perfect little scenario to hit alt zero. Oh, do we not have that? No, why is that not enabled? Oh, because I used a different mod pack. I used a different mod pack. So this mod pack is for, um, the maze challenge and we don't use that i don't know i'm not allowed to use that mod in there so i don't have it in the mod pack at all <clears throat> but now we do too much of a temptation too much of a temptation Okay, now we should be able to hop in here. Yeah. Uh, I think we did like, just because it was harder to control, like 10 miles an hour would be pretty good. Maybe 12. Love the SWU channel. Oh, you love my channel also. Brody Farms channel, yeah. What's wrong with Kbot, lol? What did, I, I must have missed something. I like this channel better than Clutch Simulations because I don't have to deal with Kbot. Hey, what's Kbot?
We will need more wagons for sure. I don't like olives. The taste was, um, she puts them on her pizza. Her girlfriend puts them on her pizza. I don't like olives either. My wife and I get two different pizzas when we order pizza or sometimes we'll do, um, when it's just the two of us, we'll do like a half and half pizza. But when it's like more of a large group where the kids are around, we'll, we'll get one that she likes better and has all that nasty stuff on it where I'm just super, um, and super, um, I'm a picky eater and <clears throat> I call it crap, but it's actually all the stuff that's like actually good for you that people put on pizza that I don't like. Clutch is annoying bot. That's funny. I'll have to check it out. Annoying voice and filter. Oh, oh, is it where his face goes? Yeah, that's, um, I don't know, Clutch. Um, I think that's, I don't think that's very entertaining at all. I think it's annoying. Yeah, so we didn't get... A... Can you put two on this? It looks like you can. We have to get a bigger tractor, too. John, how's it going? K-Bot is in Clutch Bot, I guess, right? Just got home from work. What do you? What did I miss? You missed a log tour of uh, some old save files uh, over the last year and one from prior to this channel being created. Uh, and then we've started to get back into these uh, achievement hunting that we're doing, where I need 60,000 liters of olives, and I don't know if it'll happen tonight. Where are we at right now, 9.30? Yeah, clutch is good stuff, though. I don't know I don't know anything about this K-Bot thing. I assume that that's just a, a live thing and not in his videos. Kristen, hi, I'm new here. How, how's it going? It's going good. Throat's getting a little dry. That was a long drive. This is a lot of olives. Oh, that's the wrong, wrong vehicle. Uh, we're on Big Flat, Texas. How many years has the olives been established? In this playthrough? Um, I think this will be, this is the second harvest on them. Really, this is like a fake playthrough of uh, just for achievement purposes. So I've been just kind of semi playing for real like flirting the line between cheating and not cheating yeah mcclary if you're gonna argue with the mods you're gonna get banned how many years all does the yield get better each time i don't know i don't know anything about olives I don't know anything about olives in this game. The only reason why I'm doing olives right now is for the achievement. Yeah, that's the only reason why. But I would, I, I mean, I'm sure there's some pretty good videos. It would make sense if they would um, yield better over years. Clutch is wondering the same thing with grapes. Yeah, it would it would make sense if if it would uh, if it would over years. Like, so we did sixty percent of the hopper or this harvester. 
Interesting. I think we could have made it back right now. Maybe we did treat it with fertilizer. Um, yeah, like like the older the, the trees get, the better. Or like they would have a sweet spot too when they get too old, I would imagine. All right, so back here. Oh, this is where it gets, what did we do here? See, this is where I, I'm like losing my memory now. So we probably went to the end and then it just makes sense. Like, what am I doing? Just line it up better. Silly, silly. This opening's not quite big enough. There we go. With proper proof. Yeah, so yeah, again, we would get a lot better yield if we actually took care of these, did the pruning, did the um, fertilizing and all of that. And I think you want to come through the middle of these similar to grapes, I would imagine. I, I, I don't think they would do two different game mechanics for these, whether they're realistic or not. Graham, how's it going? So close to, what? Hey, how close are we getting to 30? We've been really fortunate this year with the way the algorithm has uh, has blessed the channel. We are 38 away from 30,000 subscribers. Second harvest yielding more than the first, though. It looks to be, looking at the map, it looks to be exactly the same. Like, uh, it's not showing really good. Um, actually, let's jump in this mode. Yeah, it looks pretty dead similar. Saw something for FS25. Cool if you could have actual employees stay around. 100%. If you could actually have people on staff and instead of paying them as you use them, you could pay them a salary. And you could probably, like, man, that gets my wheels turning. I guess this is somewhat turns it into, like, an RPG game. But, like, you could also have people... I don't, don't want to say they would be better at work, but you could have, have workers that you pay more for that are more efficient. Like with their turning around and their approaches to fields. I think that would be sweet. Tristan, thank you. Tristan, do you have an IRL channel? Nice. I'll have to check that out after the stream. Alex, you think I'm thinking this through? Worked with me enough to know I don't think. That would make way too much sense. But we're going to do that right now, actually. We will, we're gonna probably pull this one aside and get two more of these. That would definitely help with this. So let's do, oh man, we're missing all kinds of mods. We don't have, we have our store mod. Let's see what we have in here, tractor wise. Um, see, this is the thing. Do these actually, do any of these work with grapes or olives? Root cart, but not olives, huh? Yeah. 
Yeah, that's so lame. Unless I'm, am I missing the icon? Oh, it is right there. So we could do that. What does this hold? gonna be strong enough for that I want that do we don't have any dual setups on these we'll do wide <clears throat> oh look what I I bought last time that's hilarious. How do I get super strength? Do you, are you, do you play on PC? So there's two ways to get super strength if you play on PC. It's with the... Oh, there's actually probably three ways. There's um, Lumberjack is what we use a lot for it. Um, there is a super strength mod, and I believe Easy Easy Dev Controls actually has a super strength option. I could be wrong on that third one. Pants? Pantsing it? Pantsing it? Yeah, on console, you don't, I don't believe, I don't, is there, I don't know, I just don't know enough about console, and that's something I might dive into, um, eventually, just to have knowledge for, for viewers, but I would look for, um, I don't, I think the, the way it works is it's a script, and those scripts don't work unless they're on PC or, um, or Mac seat of your pants yes yes and am i driving the wrong way that'd be hilarious who left a header right here i was gonna race the the train I have a PC with PC mods, and what is your favorite trucks? Um, my favorite truck is Buck's uh, square body mod that's on itch. Rental man Buck's mod. I think I'm going the wrong way. Oh yeah, we went way past where we need to go. My water cup's in the way of the map, that's why I'm looking over. So we need to go back this way, and then we'll be on the opposite side. No, we're way away from where we need to go. Console certain mods can help, but overall, we're out of luck. Yep. Charles, how's it going? What did we... Hold on. What's up, Toast? Finish scrolling down. Is it? Is the other one better? Oh man, Keith. It's alright. 
This will get the job done. We are uh, trying to harvest 60,000 liters of olives. Probably your one year is next month. Nice. Yeah, like I was saying, we've been very fortunate with uh, the way this year's unfolded. Um, when I started, I never thought it would be the way it's going right now. So let's take this. Oops, I hit the mic. Sorry. Um, oh, it's an achievement. So I'm trying to do all the achievements in game. I have cotton. We have to sell, I think, 20 cotton bales. It's not a high number. I have to look at it again. Um, I'm harvest 80,000 liters of grapes. We have to ride a horse for 90 minutes, which I'm slowly working on on another series. And... I think those four might be all that's left. Oh, and then get all of the collectibles on the maps, which we'll do all on a stream. We'll do all three of the... I think it's only three maps that that applies to. Ooh, I was going to go a lot longer, but the voice is giving. We'll see. Oh, did I not upgrade this when I bought it? <laughs> I didn't. Oh. Bulk crops unrealistic is what I wanted. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's try this again. That was a terrible approach. Careless co-worker did that? Yeah, yeah, let's go with that. Let's go with that. I mean, if I had a dollar for every time I made mistakes on this game, I'd be full-time right now. Because I wouldn't need any more money. So I bought all these fields thinking that I needed to harvest all of this for that achievement last time we did it, and we didn't need that many. Yeah, I, I, again, I have limited mods on this because I don't want all of those temptations. Um, when I'm doing the maze challenge, but I definitely should have done store deliveries. Oh, uh, you'd have to watch Nate's video to know what happened. I don't even know what, um, series he released today. I didn't, did not check. Been prepping for this and some other things all day long. Outside of doing my day job. Um, oh yeah, we went way too far. All right. Gosh! What a doofus. Yeah, it is. Keith, I'm just being... Oh, it looks like a grape wagon? Let me... I'll go look. The Ant series? Oh, really? That's what came out today? I still need to edit mine. I'm gonna look at that now. Well, his 
His title means nothing to me. I don't understand what he means by that, because... Oh, I remember what happened now. <coughs> yeah, I don't think this... I think you're right, Keith. This cart's not going to work, is it? <laughs> this is ridiculous. I'm being ridiculous. Um... I don't even know where to find that stuff. Grape technology... Doesn't show up there. Jesus. I coughed and muted. Um, so I did not, I don't update my mods. If I'm using them in a series, if I have a certain mod pack, I never hit the update button uh, because I've been burnt on that in the past. So that's pretty exciting that there's a new trailer in that pack. I'll have to check it out. Graham, I've been watching your videos since you made YouTube, since you made your YouTube channel. I love your farm builds. I'm good. I love your farm builds. I'm good at farm builds. Nice. Yeah, I'm trying to get better. I have a I have a standard for myself that I'm not hitting yet. Thank you, Alex. Since it's Texas, it would fit right into Cattle Ranch. It would fit right into Cattle Ranch RP. It, and in hindsight, um, it, well, if I wasn't doing a Rags to Riches, I probably would have picked something like Texas to do a cattle series. But since we did No, no Man's Land because it was a survival start in a, a wilderness start, I like those for that. Um, there hasn't been a lot of series that I've done solo that are on maps that already have farms and fields established. There was an update on the grape and olive harvester where the new camera angle... Really? That's my biggest complaint with, um, with harvesting grapes and olives is... Uh, I don't feel like this is good enough of a view. I feel like there could be better... Uh, side mirrors, I guess. And like this, I guess you have to turn your head all the way, try to back up. And then I have my steering wheel all confused now. Let's see if he'll even let us dump it in here, because that's was my thought. Is this even going to work? Even though it said it can do, it does. Okay. And then we can get the other trailer over. Oh, no, we can fit everything in here. It's just, how are we going to get those 20,000? I just got done watching a video of yours. Good stuff. Very relaxing. Thank you, Ash. 
Uncharted is a great. Yeah, I, I love it. Uh, Brendan hit the spot on on that. All right, we were on row three, so we'll continue here. What do you think of American Farmlands map? I haven't seen that. I don't think. Um, where's that one base? Uh, why do I keep doing this? That, then we'll turn, and then overcorrect. I need to change the sensitivity on the steering wheel, I think, for these. It would be nice to have just a, like, in-flight, like, not have to leave the game to change the sensitivity. Conveyor belt, yeah, we could do that, or we could just sell it out of that other trailer. That update has you wanting to try gra grapes. Do it, Keith. Report back to us. For another twenty thousand dollars, yeah, of our of our fake money that we have unlimited. Oh, where are we going here? We want number four. Should be good right there. We're at twenty three percent. I feel like the yield's worse, but doesn't say it. so. I know I'm getting tired when I can't complete a sentence. American Farmland map is an American-based fictional map. I believe it comes with five fields. One. Oh, okay. That would definitely be, it sounds like it would be a solo map for sure. Start a vineyard on one of your saves. Nice, Toast. I definitely enjoy it more when I'm doing something like this than when I'm making videos because my, my brain just is like, I need to, it just takes too much time. A medieval farming game. There's, um, I think you do farming in medieval dynasty. I think that's what it's called. There was a game I was looking at a while back that um, was a decent blend of of like medieval time role playing, and I believe farming was part of it and cutting down trees. Kind of similar to probably how you do farming in Ranch Simulator, even though I haven't actually jumped back into that game yet. So now we got to figure out our trailer on this end. If that one's going to be full. And at some point we want to start looking at numbers. I am like determined at this point to finish this achievement tonight, especially with the speed we're driving now. Personally did, I feel that I would stream on Twitch and upload VODs to YouTube. I mean, if you just want to, oh no, editing less stressful. Yeah, it's less views too though, typically. Um, I complain a lot, but I love the process and, and everything that we do. I just like, I'm a complainer. dry yes you do do farming in md oh my do you yeah, i thought so yeah that was that was something that might actually eventually end up on the socks way up channel i'm, I'm re uh this week's the first week of videos going back up on that there's two games that i'm going to be doing a just straight up let's play series on it's supermarket uh simulator and rockstar Rockstar Life Simulator came out today. Harry, I'm gonna call you Harry. How's it going? 
Let's see what's going on in this capacity wise. We are at 27,000. So that we're not that far off from this. So that was row four. Uh, get out of the ditch. Get out. Uh, uh, so if we go down row five now, I think we're about halfway there. I mean, granted, we did a lot of it on a stream a couple of weeks ago, about three weeks ago, I think it was. And I think we have enough. I do think we have enough olives here. Enough vine, vein. They're trees, right? They're not vines. They're trees. They're olive trees. You shouldn't have to put them in a row like that. I guess you don't technically have to, right? Can you place down just one olive tree and then spread them out however you want? It just makes sense for harvesting to do it this way. not an inconvenience can you do another long form video but I don't know if I'll be doing gold mining um, that's one of the things that if if we don't hear a announcement about FS 25 that will probably get added to my list um, I don't think I'll just say this out loud why is this almost full Okay, so this one is way better. This one's yielding way better. Um, I don't think that's in... How do I explain this? I don't want to... Hmm. I don't want to dedicate the time to a multiplayer group series on that because multiple people have to commit to that and the people that I'd want to work with on that are in the middle of that with Grant right now. And it's something I won't do solo, but... If we don't hear about an FS25, it will be added to my list of things to do for the upcoming year. Um, a couple other things. Like, I, I'm a big... So, hold on, I want to do some math here. This is going to be about 8,000. And over here, we have 27,000. So, we're a little past halfway. Um, I don't want to do... What was I saying? Oh, I have, I'm a big nerd. I have, um, what is this timeout for now? mining series just like the first series we did together yeah yeah i just i don't um i don't know i don't enjoy it to be honest one two three four five but that gets to a point where taking a break from farming is nice and then you're still making videos that kind of fit in your genre and your niche um i don't enjoy the the gold mining stuff at all i don't enjoy logging either um if i think i think if i did a gold rush thing i would actually play gold rush Yeah, sorry, Harry. I mean, it's just, it's not going to, like, you're not going to get the best quality content, right? If, if it's something that I'm not super excited about. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Blake, how's it going? I like Cattle Ranch, but I made me realize how much y'all go through. I love your videos. I mean, what do you mean by that? 
how much work we go through. Enjoy it, though. I would love to, but I don't have enough money for farming sim months. Ah, oh, gotcha. Okay, so this time we're probably going to fill up that other trailer. Let's see, we're on the sixth row. One, two, three, four, five, six right there. And then back up, get straight. It's cross platform and it's free on Xbox Pass. What is cross? Oh, yeah. Two hours in already, nice. I don't know if we're gonna make it tonight. We'll see, my throat's starting to hurt. Start from scratch goal being 10 million in 10 to 15 years. So I kind of want to, um, after doing this maze challenge that we're doing with the 10, it's 20 million. It was stupid of me to set it to 20 million. It's not going to happen. But 10 years getting 10 million off just corn and no productions or anything. It makes me want to do a start from scratch and, uh, and actually, um, and see how quickly I can get to 10 million. I want to do that as a, um, I want to do a competitive multiplayer. I say that a lot. The time will happen. It will happen eventually on the channel. Okay, this is probably going to fill this up. Oh, maybe not. So this one's at 27. This one's at 10. We're sitting at 40 right now, about. Yeah, we can do this tonight. Love to see the No Way Home series make a comeback with you all getting your money from the Yukon. Captain, you think we're going to do this? You think we can do it? One, two, three. If I can remember where, where I'm at. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. I think we have enough. I think if we just do, it's probably like four more passes or four more of these rows. I definitely think we put too many down. I mean, no way home. was not enjoyable for me. How many more subs to 30K? Let's see. Is it gonna get to the point where we just stay up for this? 36, 30, 35, 35 away. We're not staying up for that. I'll wake up to it. It'll be fun to wake up to in the morning. Stay up till you hit 30k. Gosh, You're, I'm no fun. I mean, it might, it might be like five hours. I can't talk that long. Okay, we're at 34. If it picks up, if there's people in stream that aren't, uh, that aren't subbed yet, hit that sub. Let's get to 30k. 
before the official anniversary, which is the 27th. Uncharted map. No Man's Land are great maps. Uncharted map is awesome. And I know that Brendan, he's in here. He has some plans for like finalizing that as well. Some additions. I'm almost tempted to just do the back and forth right now and then do this back half if we need it. to go. That's a fun achievement. 30,000 is a cool number. Yeah, college gets in the way of everything, Brendan. I'm just kidding. It's really good that you're doing that. Uh, I think I can see the difference in the detail now. I think this is the one we're on. I could be wrong. Let's count just in case. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep, that's the one. Oh, no, that wasn't a good approach. All right, so we needed like 50, was it 45 when we started the stream? And we need 34, so that math doesn't work in my head to, to go all night. I have to work in the morning. Touch the beta version and unsubscribe. Uncharted Steam Deck? I don't know where that came from. Oh, Steam versus Steam Deck. Steam is where you can buy PC games. Was that the right one? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No, we went one. Oh, no, we did the right one. That was the right one. That's the eighth one. Sox needs to get some sleep at some point for sure. Thirty-three to go. Thirty-three. Okay. Another eighteen hundred. So that's only eighteen. That's why I'm thinking about avoiding this top half because it's just so much time backing up here, realigning up. All right, we'll see where the sub number is. We'll see where the sub number is when we uh, when we finish this achievement. Fifteen thousand, thirty thousand. So we're at forty-five. We need fifteen thousand more liters. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's turn it into a counting stream. All right. Maybe we don't have 15,000 here. Let's see what the number is here and do some nerd nerding out. Chicken Empire, I need to work on this week's video. I got a little behind on... Uh, I took a break from Farming Simulator from... Friday to when I started stream. I typically do record one episode on Mondays, uh, whether it's before my day job or before um, if I stream. I usually try to get one video recorded, but I recorded a episode of Rockstar Life Simulator and a couple episodes of Supermarket Simulator. I really needed a break from Farming Simulator. And I think uh, reviving the Socks Way Up channel with a couple of like basic Let's Plays that are just super basic to edit is what I'm doing with that. Brody is in live chat. Yup. I've never tried Gold Rush the game, but I would be interested in playing a game that is that has gold mechanics built into it and not just mods that people created. I think that's the big uh, the big thing that makes me not want to do a Gold Rush series is it's it, the, it, the mods are so heavy and it's a it's a huge mod pack and it's it relies on on things that aren't really mechanics of the game. Is this full? I keep forgetting.
This thing's capacity is pretty nice, though. Graham, you broke your PC. You don't recommend Gold Rush the game? Any more or any more wins on iRacing? Oops, wrong button. Oh, I forgot to do the math. I think that was three grand right there. So this would put us at six thousand towards that fifteen thousand. Nine, twelve, fifteen. So if I did the rest of these rows, we should have enough. Oh, a gold mining series is repetitive. Yeah, that's that's why I that's why I'm staying away from it. I know people love the content, but it's it's tough. If I go full time this year, maybe we'll see one. Only did one race work. Oh, working on homework currently. That's important. If I would line up right, we would get there faster. And if I'd sped up speed, we would get there faster. say what it is out loud but brody the thing you wanted to stream either friday or saturday we need to we need to schedule a group a group's live with that i think it would be awesome and i don't want i don't want to spoil it i don't want to spoil it but i do want to do that as a group like a large group maybe like five of us five or six I think it would make for a great video. You know what's hilarious is looking at because of this mod and it being only like what 2% full or something? 1% full. We have 15,000 olives in here and that's all it shows in the in the mod or in the trailer. That's hilarious. All right, so I think if I do the rest of these rows we'll be good. And I I forget which one we're on. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And we have the other ones for backup in case we need them. I keep switching to keyboard and mouse here because my feet are getting tired. I have leg issues. I'm old. For some reason, I don't like home because I don't like to do homework. In fifth grade, I've got so much homework because I got really... Oh, no. Sorry, you got sick. Homework's important. All right, let's see where our sub count's at now. I don't like being obsessive over this, but we're going to stay up. I don't think we're going to, though. We need 30 more. We'll see if it picks up. Go make 30 Google accounts. I'm just kidding. Don't do that. That doesn't help anybody out. You wouldn't put me... I, I, I really like Lord Winter. You are my favorite person in chat. I am 41 years old. The name of my other channel is Socks Way Up. That's where the SWU comes from in this channel name. The, the intent was for this to be a secondary channel, and it's turned into the primary channel. Nate in chat. Uh oh. How'd recording go tonight, Nate? Uh 
Urgh. Oh, is this full? Am I a full? This is full. Okay, so let's pull this one away now. How do I want to do this part? Whoops. Graham's mind is being blown tonight. Eighteen thousand. Okay, okay, okay. I'm getting giddy. We need sixty thousand liters of olives. We're almost there. You don't mind me asking, Nate, what series was going on tonight? Uh, David, as far as I know, it is trailers is the way to go with that. And that is it, unfortunately. There might be some mods out there. I don't know if there's some mods out there for actual like storage. Another reason I stay away from it. Well, Nate, chat is trying to talk me into staying up, so we hit 30,000 subs. We're 30 away. I don't know if I'm going to make it, though. So who here is happy? I've heard the name happy. Brody is happy. Formerly known as Happy. He's like, uh, he's like Prince. Socks way up. Yes, hold on. Thirty-three thousand six hundred. Already subscribed. <laughs> Nice. Uh, calculator. 60,000 minus 33,600. So we need 26,400 26, in this one. So minus 21,708. We need 4,700 more about. happened to your camera <laughs> I shut it off for a second it intimidated sometimes all right we'll do this row and I think the row next to it and that should do it two harvester loads yep Well, we haven't even been doing full loads on the harvester, right? What does this harvester hold? May the grapes be with you. I see the, the month. Apparently. Hey, you are the best YouTuber ever. No. Apparently, Bush, I don't, I don't believe you. Oh, month in game is May. May is the grapes. Oh, okay, got you. Yeah, we're doing olives, though. But yeah, seasonal growth's off. So we get to the end here. And we'll be at around 3,300, right? Uh, Lord of Winter, we did that with the field to the right. Um, we had a harvester that held about that much and and did the same. Yeah, what is the capacity of this harvester? Oh, it's only 4,000, so we do need to unload. Okay. May the 4th. Ah, I see. There's a Star Wars... Uh, joke, huh? May the force. Is it Peter? 
so terrible with pronunciations. Good morning. Mario? B2, what's up? Yeah, what is Brody's favorite RP series? If Nate, you're still around, what's your favorite RP series all time that you've done? Cinco de Mayo? That's the 5th of May. Nate, what's your favorite RP series that you've recorded? Happy saying, happy, oh, I did it. I, it's, it I've done so good with that. Brendan saying that it is good times right now. I think good times has potential to be an amazingly fun series that we just roll with for a while. Um, Solo, I, I'll, I'll, I separate them. I, I really, I have a complete, um, different compartments in my brain for those series and I would say solo series is um, the most fun to RP for me is the farm rescues and the second farm rescue so far has been my favorite after that it would probably be whiskey and then cattle ranch and it's funny because cattle ranch has the most um, has the most views but it's it's down there when it comes to like my favorite uh, so for fun, good times, yeah. For RP, old truck, nice. I would say the first three recording sessions of Last Chance were probably my favorite that we've done as a group. I'm really enjoying good times as well. I only have had two videos out and I, I need to get the third one edited. I'm planning on getting that released on Thursday, I believe. I'll have to look at my, my calendar. Um, after that, um, there's like nostalgia ones too like I would say family RP will always be the thing the catalyst like between cattle ranch and family RP are, are like why why we're as close as we are to 30,000 let's do another check here 25 away my goodness You have a good times video, a, sh a single video, almost at 20k. That is awesome, dude. Congrats. Anything start from scratch to old mods. See, I would say like, like this is where you guys get insight on me. I am not completely enjoying old school. I, I, I'm, I'm tempted to take a little bit of a break from it. It's like I was talking to. I think, it would, I think Nate was in that conversation too with Brendan. It might have been when Brendan and I were finishing the farm build. Um, it's 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 struggle. I have a struggle with it because of the pace of the work, and it's another thing that I think I could pull off better if I was full time. And maybe I need to slow down on the amount of videos I'm doing to improve the content and then keep me happy. Um, because I started old school thinking it was going to be like the next thing that I didn't want to stop playing and I'm struggling with it. Yeah, modern equipment goes faster, work gets done faster, everything gets done faster with the with modern equipment, right? That's just the that's just the way the world works. Oh, uh, I don't even have follow me, do I? Okay, so where do we sell these? I don't care about price. Greenville sounds like a um, place that would be a train. So we're going up to the northwest corner of the map. We'll go with this one first. I noticed you don't enjoy it, especially with the rage that comes through more. I, you know, it's funny because I've been balancing trying to, um, to allow a little bit more of the personality to actually come through and 
uh, and not, and like, and making good content and breaking the fourth wall, as we say. Um, I was okay with it when it was one episode. When it when it turned into three, pretty much, is when I was like, whoa. That's why I stopped posting twice a week, old school, right now. I think console has some good mods, they're just limited. Oh, I was looking at chat, Draven. Lord of Winter says they has a ton of good mods. I haven't looked into it enough. I don't know much about it. So this is the part where I don't have my stream set up for you guys to see my desktop, and I do that to protect myself from being an idiot and accidentally showing something I don't want to. So you're not going to actually see when this achievement comes in. We're going to have to leave the game to go see it for you guys. Um, This is where you sell grapes? Or olives? Really? That was a terrible approach because I was super confused. Gold Gaming, how's it going? I don't believe you tag the right place here, game. I think this is something wrong with the, ma the map. Let's look. Her is this going to be... Hey, look at this. All right, let's get the other trailer just in case that is a mod issue there. Love your content and holy cow, most of the recording crew is in chat. <laughs> yeah, a good amount of them. It's a, it's a fun night. It's past when other people are recording. Oh, this thing going to cruise this slow? The cell point has been w weird with me before. Okay, so I, I was wondering if it was that mod, so I'll take this over there and, and find the hitbox. I might turn on the debug to try to find it as well. But I think what also gets you more besides the mods, it takes forever to do everything because the equipment usually is small. Yeah, that is, is for sure. And I think it's a, a little bit of like, um, I, I've caught myself rushing myself a lot lately, and I want to prevent that, and I think that's why I'm kind of iffy on it. And it's it's one of those things, like, for those of you that watched the last um, of Season 3 of Cattle Ranch, I was the same way. I was just done with that playthrough, and, and taking a month or two off of it, I, I wasn't. Like, I wasn't done with the playthrough. I just needed a break. 24 to go. 24 to go. I just can't jet the mods. Can't get the mods. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to the channel, absolutely. See where we can get... See where we can get here. I hope that cell point works. John, are you saying that you've sold olives there before? I'm, I, worst case, I think what we'll do with that um, that other trailer is dump into the the trailer, the three three and one trailer, because I think that takes olives, and then we can dump out of that if it is the trailer that's not working. Pallets, okay. That makes sense. It looks like a pallet sale place. Yeah, I'll be there tomorrow night. I think I have some alfalfa to cut. I was going to do the stream tomorrow because tomorrow is technically the anniversary. So because of recording, I changed that. All right, let's see. All right, we can. 
So we'll do that. <laughs> I drive a Chevy uh, Trail Boss Silverado, and I um, I do live on a farm. I just don't actively farm on it. Okay, so that was over half. Let's see if we can get to the right spot. It looks like it un. Oh, because I'm on the wrong side. Like this thing. Um, how do you open that? Unfold. So that needs unfolded. That's how you. That's how it unfolds. And then pipe out. Okay. And then we come over here, and this should do it. It's going to automatically do it. Look at that. Um. Uh, hello. Oh, look at that up there. I did my math right. That was 60,000, right? This happened last time, too. Sell 60,000 liters of olives. That was definitely 60,000. Uh, there it is. There it is. Okay, I, I guess I had to save. So now let's go save the game. We already did that. We go back to quit game. This song is terrible. Oh, I can't believe we pulled that off tonight. Achievements. So now let's look at what we don't have. Thoroughbred, that is the 90 minutes on a horse. Um, a helper. Oh, is that the, a contract one? A helper does not stop ever. Giddy up, Thoroughbred. Help me help you. That's the contract, complete a contract, 50 contracts. So I need to go look at my saves and figure out which one I were closest to 50 contracts on. Cause there's one that I finished during um, Cattle Ranch. So then we have three pigs left. And that one's a simple one, I think. That's breed 50 piglets. And then we have the cultivated. I thought we finished that. Did we not finish the cultivated one? 100 hectares. Uh, cotton is going to be. That's a wrap. Sell 40 bales. Sell 40 bales of cotton. Not harvest them. We have to sell them. And then raise the stakes is 80,000 liters of grapes. Ole Europea is the one we just achieved. Uh, and then the last three here are the collectibles, and we'll do those on a stream dedicated when those are that's all that's left. Um, the pig one will be interesting. Contract one, and then the cultivate one. Man. We have 20 to go. Whew. 10.30. Okay, I was ignoring chat. I was looking at all that. Uh, I'm gonna be recording. How many subs left? Yeah, we have 20 to go. Sweet, just my playthrough. I uh, wanted to ask if there are things getting better at work. Not as hectic anymore. Um, I think I'm adjusting to it. I wish I could join and help. Oh, yeah, we, that's okay. Lamborghini. It takes a minute to unlock. Oh, the achievement. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have to get the pallet. Uh, the 
contract one. Oh, 2B, sorry if I missed you. Good night. Yolanka is a great one to get the contracts done. Unrealistic, small, that's true. When are you going to be on here next doing grapes? So when you get the project done, we can talk about that later. We can figure out, we can we can figure that out. Um, I will not do the grapes until we do it that way. I wanted to see, because I was doing the cultivating one. That is something that I am shocked I haven't gotten on Cattle Ranch. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna switch save files. I, I'm super interested to see that. So we're gonna switch. I'm gonna take a quick break. I'm gonna switch mod packs, and we're gonna load into Cattle Ranch just to look at stats. And we might buy a field far away from um, the farm and cultivate. Yeah, Toast, I just saw your comment. Um, I banned McLaren for 24 hours. I saw too many delete deleted comments and I took it upon myself to just time him out for, for 24 hours. I'm not gonna forget. I'm gonna go fill my water up, I'll be back.
ha, ha. I wasn't on mute. All right, let's, uh, nobody look at the map. It's spoilers again. Let's look at the stats here. Really? Why don't I have the achieve? Oh, because that's acres. Let's change the... We're not far off. I just saw it. All right, I'm going to put a time limit on it. We'll go till midnight. We'll go till 30,000 subs or we'll go till midnight. All right, Hector's is on. And then stats. Ha! <laughs> we only have to do seven. All right, let's... Uh, um, I should have switched save files. Let's see. That has a big hill on it. Where do I don't care about ruining? Let's get in one of the quad tracks. Should be right around here. Ooh, where are they? Are they on the in the field? Oh, there it is. Okay. Oh, look, and it has the harp, the cultivator on it already. We're gonna drive over and do some. Uh, uh, what was it called? Some scouting. How many plots do you have now? Um, let's see. Uh, if we go farmland, we own, uh, looks like 12. Yeah. We went a little overboard. The original plan was to completely build this map out with a town and everything. And I think I'm still going to get there. And I'm really debating. Um, I got, I'm doing the last recording of Cattle Ranch this week of this uh, year. So you can see it's April right now. We have uh, Mar April, May, June, and July to get through. And then we'll be done. Like the, the farmyard will be completely rebuilt that you see there. There's gonna be a new house and, and some detail up there that I have planned out. Um, so yeah, that's uh, that's the plan. And the, and the more like future of this, I wanna do more. I possibly are gonna do streams. And that was one of the things I was debating on doing tonight was some of the city building here where I wanna build some neighborhoods and commercial areas. Cattle Ranch is still going on. I'm just doing mega cuts at this point. So I'm recording it in the background and then I'll release the super cut when it's ready, which is slated for, is it next week? It might, hmm, I don't want to give you bad information. Let me pull up my calendar. And hopefully we don't run into something while I do this. Um, today... Uh, it is... It is on the 6th when that, that is scheduled to come out. AJ, how's it going? Luis, how's it going? The process of making a town. Yeah, so this is the little start of it. There's something behind the trees there that was supposed to be like an RV dealership that I didn't finish um, that I'm going to get to. I'm going to look at 54 here. DKM. I think this one right here is definitely my favorite map. Um, I think you'd have to put it in categories, though. That's a big hill. That's a big hill. Small town, all fields easier that way. Oh yeah, the neighborhood would be would be pretty small. Um, we only have to do like seven hectares, and you can cultivate the same piece of land I think like three times. So we don't have to do an actual plot of land here. I'm gonna like, to be honest with you guys, I'm gonna. This will probably auto save at some point. 
and then I'll jump on here in my save files and I'll, I'll correct this and this stuff's not even going to be in the save long term. And let's just do that just to be safe and we'll do allow fields and let's go ahead and look at our stat so we can make sure this is working. We're at 93.82 cultivated. So we'll go for a little bit and then double check that. And then we'll increase. Oh, that's gonna be the max. Oh, hit the button, but dummy. Woo, all right, where are we at? Not gonna be able to talk tomorrow. We got 18 to go. Blows my mind. That should be far enough to see that. Yes, it is, okay. And then let's pull this up so we don't go. Which, which ones did we buy? So we can go through 45. This is, this is gonna be a quick achievement. We'll keep going, we'll do another one if we still have time. Let's see, 18 to go, yep. It's multi, yeah, yeah, yeah. AJ Spades, I'm not Alex's grandpa's farm channel is how I found him from, oh. From Formal Pickle, now I'm forever a fan. Alex, your grandpa has a farm channel? Did I read that right? This is the cultivating one. It's 100 hectares, and I jumped on to Cattle Ranch, and we already had 93 of those done. So we're just going to cultivate so we do 7 hectares. And then we're going to um, we're gonna try to Alt F4 and not um, save it. Otherwise, I'll just dump in, jump into my backup saves. Oh, Grandpa's farm. Oh, okay, sheesh. Tell you, I need to go to bed, right? Oh, I don't have access to that land. I'll pick up again right here. This is cheesy, though. I should have been making. I should be making fields doing this. This isn't good content, guys. Let's see the stat now. I'm shocked. Like I actually was shocked that I haven't. I hadn't done a hundred on this playthrough yet. Grandpa's Farm is the series I did with Nate. Gotcha. So that back and forth like three times and we're done. Thirty K subs. It's great to hear. I'm working on getting two fifty. Tell you the first uh Brody, I just went over all that. I'm just kidding. Yeah, I just showed it. I don't. I didn't count. Do the count. But there's the three. Um, sorry, let me finish that other comment. 250. You're working on getting 250. The first like, the first hundred are super hard. They're they're the hardest, right? And then, then there's tiers that they get relatively easier. Um. It was like six left, so I had the three achievables. I have the horse one, I have make, make breeding pigs, cotton, grapes, and this one. So I think it is six. Um, yeah, it's first, the first thousand's rough. It is rough. And then I seem to hit like a, a happy spot where we went from, we went from like 1,000 to 5,000 really fast, and then and then all of a sudden we were at 10,000. It's very interesting. I'm trying to see if I can beat you to get done, but I have like 12 left. <laughs> I mean, I'm relatively cheating too, right? Like, so it is debatable whether or not this is legit. Yeah, it's gonna still take a minute to do this much. <clears throat> Darwin, absolutely. We're not going anywhere. We're just getting started on this channel. achievement speed run I think I think we should do a friendly bet amongst the group that starts when when 25 comes out or or the next game 
And, and we'll do like a who gets there fastest. The, the one that's like the kicker is the horse one, right? Like you gotta do 90 minutes. You gotta ride around on a horse for 90 minutes and nothing says whether or not that's total. I don't even see, maybe I'll look at the stats and see if something shows that. We're gonna hit a tree. Let me, let's let's look at that. Is there anything in here? Um, Work time, plow time, soy harvest, drive distance. Yeah, so I don't know how that's being tracked. Why do you think I've been on the horse so much on uh, Uncharted? That was gonna be my plan in good times. I was gonna, I was gonna not use my truck, and I was just gonna ride a horse around. But then I stupidly. I mean, I love it, but I stupidly bid on the Mustang and that kind of, I was like, ah, I got to drive the Mustang a lot now. I was going to ride from, from farm to farm on the horse until I got that achievement on that series. Does it say you have to be moving it? it uh, what is it's like giddy up? I can pull it up here in a second. Let me just share the page that I've, I've been looking at. I'm gonna run into something. Yeah, I knew I was driving crazy. I tabbed away. The Mustang is technically a horse. Yeah, absolutely. Technically a to go it's gonna be one of those things where a bunch of people unsubscribe when we get close isn't it and I'll go to bed that's how you avoid a tree right there Ninety minutes in the Mustang. Heck yeah! All right, we got three to go. Two point two point six to go. Graham, you need to go to bed. You can't tell a dad that hopefully your dad doesn't catch you. Father instincts kick in right away. You won't miss anything. It'll be on the channel. You can watch it. Dirt track. Heck yeah! That's what I should have done. I should have made a dirt track out here and used it to... Oh. Should have done that. I think I skipped your comment and probably not asked how many subs do you feel like you have enough to go full time? It's not necessarily a sub thing. It's... Um, it's... Um, it's consistent revenue for an X amount of time. Uh, and also there's, there's a lot going on outside of just YouTube that will help um, pull that off. And I have a selfish goal of, I have a goal of knowing the date for sure. I want to be able to say I know the date by June. I want enough things to come into place where I know that if things keep progressing the way they are, then I, in June, I'll be able to say by November or by January, that's the plan. Like paying off a certain amount of debt. Um, my my wife is starting a wedding venue and we've been re renovating a, a building for the last year, a little over about 13 months now. Our first event for that is in April. So we'll start getting some revenue coming in from that and Oh, uh, actually today we got officially approved for our liquor license like we are officially official for that and we have the health department um, not the health department so the building inspection tomorrow for that 
so that's that stuff's wrapping up and that's like one of the dominoes that needs to fall to get us to where we can confidently go full time um but yeah so it, it, i'm hoping this calendar year but if it doesn't happen it it it, it, it will eventually if things keep tracking the way they are, I should say. Super close, super close. I'm a director for a software company. We do, my team does um, automates creation of uh, virtual machines and helps teams quickly deploy their code changes to production and all environments. Uh, I've been doing that for about, gosh, 13, 14 years now. Thanks, Alex. Yeah, that's a huge step for us. Like we knew it was going to happen, but it was like we we're getting to the point where we we're worried that it wasn't going to be done before that first uh, event that we had booked. So super excited about that. Like the health department should be the easy one at this point. Matthew, I'm doing good. How are you doing? Yeah, so I started as a Java developer and did that for about four years. And then I fell in love with automation and automating the uh, just tasks that other team members were doing and I transitioned into that and it's a space called DevOps and, and software development and we do it like blends operations and development together is where the term came from and it's just turned into a buzzword at this point has to be expensive build be expensive build and no cops are coming to arrest you for the <laughs> you know it's so funny because there's so much going on in life that is uh like parallel to to the stuff that that goes on in um, in the videos and like eventually I think it would be sweet to to have crops here and do and make my own whiskey. I don't think I would ever do it to the point where I would need a license for it. But um, but yeah, it is. It's, there's a lot of similarities and it's a lot of uh, pulling from real life to to make some inspiration on on some things. Oh, nice. DKM, just subscribe to the... Oh, you, you subscribe to DKM Farms channel. I thought I read that wrong. Where are we at? Where are we at? 16 to go. Wombat, yeah, it's a 100% accurate statement right there. It is fun sometimes. And other times, it is the opposite of fun. It's one of those things in practice sounds awesome and implementing it and dealing with it day to day. It gets uh, very tedious and uh, annoying. Dog, I'm doing great. We're having fun. We're, we, we've been kind of bullied into staying online and, and keep streaming. So we hit 30,000 subs and we're 16 away. Uh, but I've also put like a rough time limit on it from like an hour from now. If we don't hit it in the next hour, I'm, I'm going to bed because I have to work in the morning. I think it's one of the reasons it's going good because so that makes, makes it more unique. I, I think so too. Fully now, yeah. I guess I shouldn't use that term so loosely. That is a serious term. I wasn't bullied. Just a little pressure. Yeah, right. Yeah, exactly, David. <laughs> uh, this should have been done. Nope. Nope. Just a little bit more. Under pressure. Some Bowie. Ansible Kubernetes. Yeah, now you're talking my language right now. consider working out to get my tractor light. walking out to get your truck you know it's so funny i've thought about the same thing um yeah it looks like you have the similar setup as us we 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 use ansible for provisioning vms we use ansible for not provisioning vms but um for configuration on things and then we use packer and terraform for a lot of things as well but kubernetes is definitely our world um i manage an open stack deployment so we have our own cloud environment our own pub private cloud um pretty pretty boring stuff to people that don't understand tech pretty interesting stuff to people that know what you're talking about um yeah i've been working in kubernetes for 
six, seven years now? No. Yeah, just about six years. John is a supervisor in a different field. Doing a job can be easy if it's managed. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, Nate. It's boring stuff. It pays the bills right now, though. 15 to go, guys. Let's do this. Ooh, what was that? There's the achievement. Yeah. All right. So we're going to... What are we going to do next? I don't want to save this. There. We got the achievement, though. We'll jump back in and look at the achievements now. Um, this mod pack should be fine. I'm still here. Just uh, switch to this while the computer and stuff figures itself out. All right, let's see. What is the next interesting one? We could ride around on a horse and just chat until we get 15 more subs. Contracts, we could start up a... I don't think I have any saves that are close. Your little piggies. Um, raising the stakes. And then these three, we're gonna do a different night. Oh, let's switch screens. Let's, let's switch scenes. Raising the stakes is the grape one. We're waiting for Brendan to do something for that. Cotton, we could technically get back on that other map. Um, how about the map where you, yeah. So the problem with that is the contracts didn't work. The contracts were broken. Where is that? Um, yeah, I'd have to switch mod packs. Uh, start a new save. That's what I'm thinking. I think I want to try. I think for the rest of the night we're going to do that. We're going to start a new save. And... I think I'm going to take a look at this. Hot. Uh, this is gonna be a mistake, but we're gonna we're gonna use every. Oh yeah, I thought it automatically removed that. I need to just uninstall this mod pack. I need to extract Cattle Ranch out to its own mod pack and then kill this mod pack because this is like the old school mod pack. The White Farm is a one X map, and all the contracts are not broken. Oh, interesting. I'm watching on my phone at work, getting some OT in. Nice. Uh, the problem with the Empire Challenge contract. Yep, yep. And there was, there he was faster than me. <laughs> it's awesome. You're the one that reminded me of that last time. Oh, Graham, you said something in here. Let's see. I don't know if you said anything before the divorce. Yeah. Unfortunately, uh, I put my daughter through the same thing, and it's it's not fun for anybody. But I don't know how long ago it was. Life life goes on. Things things uh things get better. What did I do for? Did I just do new farm? Hopefully they uh they they can get along and keep your best interests in mind throughout the whole process. Okay, oh, it's kind of nice. All right, let's see. Let's start a new adventure. See, like, so what do we do here? Do we, all these fertilizing ones, do we grab, like, do we have stuff for that already? We do not. So what I would like to do, we have a hundred grand and we have this. So let's go in here. And what is, what has the, the biggest width? 
Actually, let's be sm Should I do this? Um. Oh, man. I stopped scrolling. Four deliveries for the win. Wombat with great advice right there. Graham, read that comment. I don't play any map that I can't easily use large equipment. I mean, yeah. The shop's 10 feet from the farm. That's funny, yeah. Um. Oh. There we go. Got my cursor back. This one's 18. This one's 36. Um, this one, I, I like this one. It probably would work on the equipment we have here, too. Yeah, let's just do that one. We're going to go ahead and do this. Um, yeah, we'll buy that. Why not? Okay, where are we at on here? Is this... Is this farm in my save? I don't think these buildings are in my save for the maze challenge. Huh. Because this is the store, right? Interesting. Okay, we're going to go here. Um, conch. Oh, yeah. Let's, uh, let's. I just drove over here. <laughs> let's reset it. I don't know why I drove over. Oh, why are these going away? Forgot this map does that. All right, we'll grab those three. So we'll start off with that. And then now back to here. And it's fertilizer that we need. There we go. No wing collision. You only get the building. For oh, interesting. That's a pretty well done map then by Giants. I, I dig that. All right, so 55. Let's go grab. That one's right here. Let's do that one first. Uh, we have precision farming on, so we're going to be able to see this really easy too. So we're over three hours in. This is going to be the longest one I've done. Oh, oh, oh. Well, let's get out of here. 14 to go. Watch, it's gonna like come to a crawl here and just chill at like 14. All right, so now we see blue. Why is it blue? Do I have colorblind mode on? Why is it blue? Hopefully this gives us the credit for it. Oh, yep, that was terrible. Oh, you know what we need on this? We're, we're gonna go back to the, the store real quick. Ah! Oh. As contractor, it's blue. That shows you how much I've done that, okay. Well, it's not blue on this map because I use precision farming for the maze challenge that I do on this map. But I, I've never done a contract for fertilizer on this map. Um, I don't know if I've ever done a spring. I don't know if I've ever done a contract, to be honest. Uh, customize. And we're going to spend 15 grand right there. Modern Maker, thank you. Yeah, all of you are, are the reason why we're possibly staying up tonight for for this achieve or achievement, this uh, sub goal apparently that we made in the middle of the stream. Fourteen to go. 
Achievement hunting. Okay, so let's go over... Let's do this end row here. Let's do this smart. Even though we're driving through this crop that we probably shouldn't be driving through. Let's just go... Give us a space to be able to turn around. And then we'll set up <clears throat> guided steering. And we'll get this one done super fast because of that. And because of this. Speed run. Working my way to a thousand. You'll get there. Don't give up. Keep pressing. Keep getting better. Spend more time on your thumbnails and your titles. Spend twice as much time thinking through those things than you think you need to. And that is advice I should be giving myself as well. Gosh, I love speed override. Especially when I'm doing stuff like this. It doesn't make for realism, though. Alright, we're going to loop around here. We're going to enable... Oh, uh, let's save material here. So I'm tempted to just play this legit, but we're not going to be able to do that. Um, we'll enable, and then we'll go in here, and we'll go to auto width. And facing, I believe we're going... This is the right direction, right? Yes. So we'll lock into place and let guided steering be our guide. Uh, let's uh, go to like, what does it recommend? 12. We'll do 12. We're not going to do all of these tonight, so no reason rushing. I was surprised because usually when I join the stream, you're about to end. Yeah, it's, it, they, they talked me into it. At 12 is our oldest video going to say one year. It should. It should if it doesn't already. Um, yeah, it doesn't show me in. I was looking in YouTube studio. Uh, are we going to have enough fertilizer for this? We're going to have to get more, aren't we? We'll do the end cap here, the end row. I love, I love guided steering. I don't necessarily use it going this direction all the time. Like, we, I could, but I'm just trying to give us enough of a gap for turning around so it's not that big of a deal. I like it when the streaming starts at 8. Garmin, what time zone are you in? So we were just talking about that. You must have been gone. I do software development. Quick answer for that. I N? What's I N? P A? In P A? Oh, so you're in your Eastern time? Oh, he zoned out. Okay, 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 okay. It's not looking good, guys. We're still at 14 to go. And then we should be... Oh, we went a little too far. I was going to try to smoothly turn back into the guided steering, but we went a little too far. I should have done the sea and spray. And then we'll lock in. Turn it back on. There we go. It's 11 here now. Yeah, it's 11.16 for me as well. I wasn't prepared for this long stream. I'm running out of things to talk about. Let's slow the time down just in case. And then we're going to min max this for sure. This one is this. We're at 37%. We're not going to waste material that we don't need to use. 16, 616 in the morning here. 
Oh, wow, it's early. Oh, no, 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 don't, don't fold. I always mess that up. And then we'll get to where it says plus two, lock it in. And let it dry for us. If you put the sprayer on front, oh yeah, that's true. Get the extra capacity. I'm in, I'm in Michigan. I'm in the UP. That's a pretty cool looking tractor. Graham here in Florida. The Dino 2 self-propelled sprayer on the on this works great. Yeah, that would. You get up at five usually? Oh wow. Kansas. Yeah, where's everyone from? That's a great topic. It's kind of interesting, like we were talking about um earlier streams like daytime streams and the different time zones that you're able to get people because of that like it hurts some of the u.s um viewership but it helps with like the europe viewership got a couple more uh, florida virginia oh that's true those are pretty they're way wider aren't they northwest wisconsin okay Used to live in Tennessee. Upstate New York. Got Utah, Maine. Wow, we got a lot. It's so cool. So Germany in the house. South Africa, nice. That's so cool. Like that's that's like, and I used to say this on Twitch too. Like it's one of the things I love about this is like. Forget all of the drama of the world. This is where we can just be humans and enjoy each other's, you know, common interests. And yeah, that's what it's all about for me. Pennsylvania. My mom's family's from Pennsylvania, the Clarion area. Indianapolis suburbs recently moved from Chicago suburbs. Nice. Another Wisconsin in there. I joke and say we live in northern Wisconsin, but we're we're in the UP. How many subs? Yeah, we are hitting a wide wide range in the audience. It's so cool. Twelve to go. Not a bad pace. No toast. Toast. That's the easiest way to get banned for my channel or timed out. That is not a thing. That is not a thing in this on this YouTube channel. Got a North Carolina on here, nice. Long Island. Looks like we need to fill up after this. You're about to get him. Yeah, no, it's, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 11 to go. Isaac, how's it going? I think we're, yeah, it said 82% right there. 82%. Born in Franklin on a horse farm in Tennessee. Nice. All right, we're out. Gosh, I just don't know if we're gonna. That other, the spreader, the spreader would be way better. That is, there's no doubt on that right now. Oh, I thought I cleared it. I thought I cleared it.
Oh, David was warning you as well, Toast. That's what that was. Yeah, I think we're going to sell this, this implement here after we use all of our... Yeah, buy the spreader. I agree. I agree. We're going to finish this contract because I'm stubborn, though. Oh, don't hit the... Okay, whew. I learned how to drive from Nate. Uh, I keep switching to the key the keyboard. That is all keyboard right now. But no, that was just that was. There's no excuse for that running into the fence because I just didn't close the, the sprayer in time. Yeah, so I had a feeling you weren't serious, but. That was close, because someone could have been like, alright, let's do this. Alright, this should be the last pass here. And halfway through it, we'll probably get the notification that we're done with the contract. crashing enough. That would be a good achievement. Alright, there it goes. Shut it off. Um, yeah, I want to collect that right now. And then we're going to go sell this. And we're going to... Who cares about this 167 gallons that we have in here? Master Achievement, yeah. Nate uses controller. Okay, bye. All right, now we have those other two contracts, so let's go in here. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? See, is this one's 42 meters? Is it? Oh, we have some mods though. It's only 12 meters. 36. This one's 42 meters. And it's only $28,000. What is its capacity, though? Capacity is 4,000. If we do lime eventually. No, there's nothing wrong with using controller. I was just saying he's not using, he doesn't use keyboard. Um, this one has extensions on it too, right? Yeah. Let's do that. And then we'll buy, I can't imagine us needing more than, what is solid fertilizer? I always forget what's the best way to do it. It's probably this. Solid fertilizer, we'll buy, oops, let's cancel that. We'll put three bags in there. I didn't even look at the field sizes. I'm just guessing. I mean, certain games, the controller is is the best on, right? Oh. Oh, because it's yards. I was like, man, that loads slow. Uh, There we go. Okay, so this is 30 and 77. Let's look at the map. Where's the closer ones? Why didn't we get the tiny ones? 30 up north there. 77's got to be right there. Okay. 
We'll hit those both up. Yeah, it depends on what it is. This game, I prefer steering wheel. I want a joystick, though. Definitely want a joystick. Um, we're going to... I don't think... Uh, crop destruction might be on. We're never going to harvest our own field there. A, a real playthrough on this map would be fun, though. do my job. Oh, 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 oh. This is where we want to be. Yeah, this is the entrance to that field, I believe. Kind of interesting doing fertilizer contracts on corn like this. It's like a single pass right here. I'm pretty close. Almost. Wow. 10%. Ten, 10%. Is this contract going to be bugged? I hope not. You use the, yeah, I use the G90, the 920. All right, so that one's good. We'll drive farther north to field 30. what you're asking there right. but we need eight more subscribers and then the unsubscribe train starts where'd Brody go he's like egging me on to keep stay awake and he's been silent Do not unsubscribe. It's like, I'll just go to bed. Like, <laughs> we get close and I start seeing it go down. I will just end the stream and go to bed. We have seven to go. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Thanks for joining. I'm ready. I'm ready time to hit. subscribe twice that's hilarious and we get this in one pass oh blue is the regular color for fertilizer i'm a dork that's not the, that's when you're not using precision farming sheesh that says you how long it's been since i played this game without precision farming i apologize everyone's probably like what is he talking about Uh, that had to have been, yeah, finished. Okay, let's grab these contracts now. Let's go complete that. Complete that. Like, in this challenge, is this harvest even worth it doing? Like... Oh, nice. I do some more iRacing. Uh-oh. What did Graham get redacted for? 
Oh, redacted. That means you remove the comment. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Hey, Keith, with the jokes. Four to go. Wow. Glad I stayed up for this. Good call, guys. It's pretty crazy. I didn't think I'd ever see 10,000. Like, seeing 30,000 now, that's just... My mind is blown. I'm kinda, kinda speechless. Four to go, wow. Sixty-five days and we get to do this in real life. Hello from Snowy. Yeah, you know, I'm looking forward to um, it not looking dead outside. Like we haven't got a lot of snow this year, so it's it's not. It doesn't even look like winter outside. It just looks like the end of fall when everything's dead and snow hasn't hit. It's yeah. All right, let's go back to our house here. And we're going to just, um, oh, look at all of this new equipment I'm not going to use. Oh, root crops. Oh. All right. This house is kind of cool, though. They did pretty good with this DLC, I think, with the assets. I would assume this is it. Let's see what the contracts are next. Ahmad, how's it going? How long did you first? Oh, I wish I knew that. That's something I'll, have, I'll try to go back and find out. I think it was like three months. It was super fast. It didn't take long to get. Um, it didn't take very long to get monetized. And I always credit that to this not being my first um, channel. Um, so some of the. I'm going to borrow the items on that one. I would say some of the like educational part of um, figuring out YouTube, I didn't have to go through. So I think that I think that definitely helped. Um, meeting Nate helped. Oh, now I need to remember what field these are for. Oh, I'm a doofus. Two to go. What's wow, Nate? I gave you credit. What field? Oh, will it tell me? I'm getting tired. I'm getting so tired. Cultivating the large one is 66. Okay. 66 is right there. Okay. Yeah, I don't want to say it was I think I did say it was easy. I didn't it wasn't easy. It was a lot of hard work, but it wasn't um it wasn't it wasn't as long of a drag as a lot of people deal with, so I was lucky. And, I, and again, I do think some of the learning was Oh, one to go. It was because of it. That's so cool. That's so cool. Like refresh the refresh the 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 phone time right now. Should have changed the title. Can you do that on on uh, YouTube? Can you change the title of streams like you can on Twitch? Which one's 66? Or this one. We're there. We hit it. We hit it. More time goes on, the more your content will be seen, the more we'll subscribe, David. I, I yeah, that seems to be. I 
I didn't think I'd hit it tonight. That is so cool. Thank you guys. Every single person has been part of this. It is so freaking cool. That is so cool. That is cool. Like 10,000 was cool to see that extra digit pop up. Seeing that two that's been there for a long time, not a long time, but for a decent amount of time, turn into a three. That's that's so cool. Let's hear my speech. I, I think I just gave it. That was, that was about it. I've been giving a speech for three hours and 45 minutes. Uh, this one's going to be 90 degrees, right? Yep. Lock into place. Drive. Holy crap. I'm a little tiny bit emotional right now. I'm wondering if someone could shout out my YouTube channel. There, I just did, Graham. Yeah, honestly, thank you, everyone. You can't, you can't give a speech when you're speechless. Working, Jake. Work at it. Keep working. You'll get there. I don't think it's that far. My contacts might be bothering me. It's pretty freaking awesome, though. I'm trying to. I was trying to downplay it for a little bit, but it is. It's hitting me. Tractor's not weak. It kind of is weak. Why did they set this up? Oh, it's just the hill. It's because it's green. Haha. <laughs> Ricky, thank you. That is a heck of a milestone. On to the next one. We're not very far from Nate hitting that too. Nate's gonna be right behind me. Nate, you need to do a live stream when you hit yours too. What's really gonna be emotional and there might be a tear in my eyes is if we ever get to the that six six digit yeah that's six digit number that's pretty freaking cool yes brody your channel is about to blow up we're getting through getting through the uh name change Alex's channel's blowing up. Yoshos is doing good. William just hit a thousand too, right? Yeah, honestly, like we we're kind of talking about the um, the numbers thing and like the waves, and even without the name change, there was going to be a little bit of a a dip there. Like you got to five thousand super fast, and now you got like seventy three hundred. Gosh, dang. Me play American farming? No, it's not going to happen. <laughs> I don't have a setup to play anything mobile on my computer or here, and uh, I don't play mobile games. Oh, those are all my mods. They're all they're all friends of the channel. Oh. I am I am a little I don't know what to say. I am blown away. So I was absolutely selfishly looking at that number and hoping we would hit it tonight. Um when the night started, I didn't think we'd get anywhere close to it. Oh, is this the end of the map? <laughs> like, why can't I drive? That looks so good for the end of the map. 
I'm gonna take note on that. Well, that's one thing we haven't talked about. I am gonna start working on a map eventually. I just need to dedicate time to it. And I wanna do some of it live. All right, this is the last. Um, I think we might just leave it right there, actually. Uh, what is my favorite tractor? We have a lot of mods on this on this uh, set. Let's go through here. Um, honestly, like, to play the game, I, like, I really do like the field boss. Um, I don't, it's got to be in here somewhere. I forget what size it is. Yeah, I, I, I really like cruising around in this and using it for having 125 horsepower for, you know, a medium-ish tractor. I think it's awesome. Um, outside of that, I would say, like, you can see all the stuff from the, the New Holland Challenge. That's one map we didn't look at. Um, this thing. So many mods in here. Uh, I, I lean towards like the big boys. Like I right now we have the which one is it? The one we were just driving in. See, I don't memorize numbers. I've never been somebody that memorize names of things. Like a nine. Almost a four hour stream, but that's where we're going to end it. I'm going to throw. Um, oh, and like I, I doubt anybody or many people are here that were that were from the beginning of the stream. But the um, the song was uh, from my band in 2003. The name of the song is called Complicated. Right now, there is no way to hear it other than on this stream unless the other guys have, you know, they have versions of it. But I was the bassist and backup vocal. Um, a Model H? God, that'd be so cool. Uh, yeah. So I'm gonna I'm gonna kick off that as the ending as well, and I will see you guys next time. If I can remember how I did that, there it is.
from deep inside of me. I, I need the breath of your life to set the center free. The ways are complicated, they're straight up laid up inside of me. I need to breathe. Set me free.